sit down. Sit down for a minute. Sit down. Just sit. Just sit down. You're good. Sit your butt on that. Sit down. Can you can you scoot up this way? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. He's trying to see how much he weighed and he won't let me weigh him. He won't let me weigh him. There's where he scratched him a bald spot. Poor little baby. Hi, Dizzy. Hi, Barbie. Oh, it's raining here. I'm sleepy. Look here, rascal. Hi, dude. Look at him. Say, ain't a pretty boy. Ain't a pretty. Mm -mm -mm. Say, look at my mama. I scratched her. No, I bit her there. He bit me there. Just jumping and biting, jumping and biting. Hey, Jamie, he scratched me here and it was bleeding. So, so anyway, so he's just a little wild child. Hey, Bobby, how are you? And he wants mommy today. He wants mommy. He's just jumped on me and jumped on me and jumped on me. Look at him. Say hi to the peoples. Say hey, peoples. Say hey. I'm snoozing. Hey, Jen. Hey, Maury. Oh, my goodness. He's a muggy. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Let's text Bubby and say, come get rascal. So, I saw that some of y'all saw my dessert I had. Didn't it look good? Mm -hmm. Uh oh. He just he just melts into me. So he's a mess. Yep. Mm hmm. I think he likes me. What do y'all think? He is a, he is adorable. But when he's hell on wheels, jumping and biting, mommy has gotten to slapping back when he bites. <laughs> he don't like that. It hurts his feelings. So, but the skin on my arms is so thin from being burnt. It don't take much and he has me bleeding good. So, Anyway, but yeah, I swat at him for biting at me, so, yep, he's a snuggle bunny, that's for sure, and uh, <laughs> he thinks when we go to bed, he's learned how to jump, I don't even put him in the bed with us no more, he can jump up by himself, have a bench at the end of the bed, and jump up by himself, get up in there, but he thinks that he has to lay in my face, <laughs> And um, his little flea collar, his little flea collar makes my throat close up. So, anyway, he's, he's just, so I'm always pulling him off of my face. So, look, I got an ink pen. I think his color is pretty. He's got just a pretty soft, fawny color. Here comes Bubs. There you go. Gotta go, Bubbers. Oh, he's gained some weight, Jared. Last time I only he weighed in the three-pound range. Today he weighs in the four-pound range. Hey, Vex and Rose, how are you? Sandy, let's see. Did I, I said hi to Jude and Maury. And let's see. Bobby. Hey, guys, how are y'all? I have a bunch of cool stuff today. Um, Look at my earrings I got. Can you see these here? I'll pop it out of my ear. I got these today. I got these out at um, got these at Jude's auction uh, that she had for to raise money for the um, uh, people suffering with COVID in 
Peru. Was it Peru? I think so. Anyway, my hair is wild. It is raining here. We have rain from the uh, tropical storm. So, hey, Perla, how are you? Anyway, and I got a turtle from Jude. And I got another turtle that I won from Jude. And then I got a turtle that I won from Barbie. And I got a um, uh, an anklet that I, somebody gave me in the auction at Jude's. So, anyway, hey, Robin, how are you, sweetie? I said hi to Vexen. I said hi to Maury, Sandy, Jude, Bobby, Barbie. feel like I'm missing somebody. Uh, Jamie. Let's see. Just want to make sure I'm getting... Oh, Dizzy Angie. There's Dizzy. And Jen Layton. Yeah. So, anyway, so we've got some... Oh, hey, Carolyn Gambrel. How are you, sweetie? We've got... We're going to do our warm-up. I only have, I think, seven or eight items on it. And uh, we've got several things. And some of these are going to be $2, and some of them is going to be $3. This one is going to be a $2 one. So, we have these two pairs of earrings. Uh, they're both, this one, they're both plastic, and they both have, uh, French hooks, fish wires, um, and two dollars if you want these pairs, two pairs of earrings for two dollars, um, they are, your word is going to be blue, and I will tell you, I have not opened them to examine what the hooks like, look like, so, um, the hooks may need replaced, but, um, blue is your word on that, and it's two dollars on that. Two dollars blue. Two dollars and your word is blue. You get two pairs of earrings. And I'm not going to linger fat long on these. I will go pretty quick on these. <clears throat> Looking for the word blue if you want these blue earrings. Oh, we had a we had fried cabbage with sausages and cornbread for supper. Hey, Josie. Welcome, 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 welcome. And then I had um, white nectarine with strawberries and blueberries for dessert. And Dave had cornbread and milk for dessert. <laughs> so, anyway, he called it his redneck dessert. I said mine looked better. So... Anyway, I, yeah, I had several agree with me, so that was over on his page. So, we have this, um, okay, nobody said blue, so I'm going on, okay? So, this one here is $3. This is a $3 lot. We have this pendant. It is signed with a D, and it says stainless steel, but it's copper colored with a silver tone bell there. Which I dropped, and, but it just slides around. So we have this pendant, and then a pair of silver colored hoops, and these will be uh, three dollars. And if you want this, uh, your word is going to be copper. Copper, copper is your word. So, and three dollars is the price on that. It's Jamie is who's here. Is what she said a while ago, Robin, that she was Jamie. So, anyway, so yeah. So, and uh, copper is the word on that. You have a copper pendant with a pair of silver tone earrings. And these are a clip on, and what were they signed? Were they signed? can't remember. Yes, they're signed. I have to look and see what they say. Oh, ART. A-R-T. And these are going to be... Oh, thanks. I've got my that on. I've got my green turquoise ring on. Uh, my <laughs> Celtic ring. My ammonite ring and my fishy turquoise thing 
And I'm trying to look and see how much of this I bought from Jude. Got that from Jude and that from Jude and that from Jude. I don't remember if that came from you or not. I know I didn't buy this from you. The uh, green turquoise I bought over at the um, um, Hidden Treasures over at uh, uh, Waldron. So, okay. Uh, art brand enamel earrings. The, the, uh, they are teal colored. And they're going to be $2. Okay, $2. And the word on these are is teal. $2 on these. Teal. And if those look familiar, I, I've had them in. Some may just change their mind, which that's not an issue. So, teal is your word. Hey, Vanessa, how are you, sweetie? Okay, I got you, Miss Bobby Pazelli. This is... I'm just putting the number two dollars. There we go. Put them back in there. So I have these little button earrings. There's two pairs. One of them has what looks like birds to me. And the other one has blue glitter, and this will be $2. If you want these, glitter is your word. Glitter is your word. Hi, Cheryl Seaver. Uh, we didn't have storms here last night. No, we didn't have any storms here. Um, I was trying to think when the last time we had storms was. We've had a lot of rain, but no storms. So, uh, glitter is the word on these little button earrings. So, two dollars is the price. It's a dollar a pair. No, well, we're just now getting the after effects of it today. We're getting rain today, and we were supposed to get a whole bunch of wind, but it, it did not come. So, did not come. Um. I think I may have got this from Barbie, but I'm not sure. Anyway, it is adjustable. And I actually had it adjusted so I could wear it on this finger here. So it's adjusted quite big, but it does adjust back down. And it's turquoise colored. Let's see if we can get the color there. It's a real pretty turquoise color. And then Dave says, and it's so pretty. Hey, Dave, will you come fill my tea glass up? would be real good if you would anyway let's see this little ring is going to i didn't get it from you this little ring is going to be two dollars two dollars actually it's not little it's quite large two dollars and your word is going to be adjust adjust there is some wear on the back of it but the front of it has no wear there is i kept seeing a hair it's caught in my finger on my finger Hold on. It's caught in my nail polish. Adjust. I got you, Bobby. Thank you, baby. Let's see. That was number five. Okay, here we go. This one is going to be $3, guys. This one is going to be $3. Uh, this is faux, and it's actually plastic. But it's really pretty. On this heavy rope chain, you have this turquoise-looking cross uh, with a deeper blue turquoise in the, in the back. Uh, yeah, a lot of people serve beer in these kind of mugs, too. 
my mom gave me a bunch of them. I don't know where she gave, got them. She gave me like six or seven of them. Anyway, so this is going to be $3 in cross is your word. Cross is your word. The uh, chain is... The chain is right at 24 inches long. I got you, Miss Josie. Hey, Cece, how are you? And this is the last one. This is number seven. This is the last one. You've got this antique gold chain. It looks like a good cleaning is do it because you got a little bit of discoloration there, but I think cleaning will do it. And then it's got these little thingies here. And uh, we'll do $2 on this one. Two dollars on this, and if you want it, then fringe is your word. Fringe is your word. Two dollars. Sleepy, is it raining there in your part of the state? It's raining at our house, but not hard, just drizzly. Uh, fringe is your word. Two dollars is your price. Got you, Cheryl. Okay, guys, <laughs> that's fun. Just in case you wanted to know, uh, hey, Green Fairy. Um, just in case you wanted to know if it's magnetic, it is. My bracelet has magnet fasteners, and that stuck to it. So, okay, all of these other things can go over here in this little baggie right here, out of my way. So. Let us get started. We have some cool things today. Some very, very neat things. Including the, at the end, we have a uh, jewelry bag that has uh, over 30 pieces of jewelry in it. A lot of it is the... Let me just show you this. Okay. This is going to be the final thing of the night. It's a little Ipsy bag. It's holographic. And has... Anyway, and it's got over 30 pieces of jewelry in it two pieces of sterling and it has a whole lot of stone beaded items in it that are stones um there's rose quartz uh let's try to look and see what else there is a uh there's some jasper <clears throat> the uh yeah anyway but there's quite a few things in it that are are stone items so let us go okay guys some of this stuff came from pennsylvania <coughs> from my friend in pennsylvania and this little necklace did it is not silver and it is, not, as Barry says, it is not Monet. <laughs> but it is cute. Where is my little ruler? There it is. And it comes in a nice little box. It is vintage. You are back. I thought Bubby took you to the bedroom. It's 24 inches long. It is a religious symbol. It is, it is Jesus on the cross. little cross and we're going to start the bidding on this at a dollar going to start the bidding on this one at a dollar at a dollar guys i have several crosses tonight so yeah rascal just he just came back hi rascal hi bubbers got josie in at a dollar come on uh-oh. There. Say hi. 
Say hi to your peoples. Say hi, my peoples. Oh, big yawns. He wants to take a nap on Mama, but Mama won't let him. This is what he does. He bites at me all the time. No bodies. No bodies. No lickies, neither. So, you're welcome, Sharon. Got Miss Josie in at a dollar on that necklace. Okay. You have to go because Mommy has to do this, okay? You have to go lay down on your dress. Good boy. So, we've got Miss Josie in at a dollar. Hey, Judy Daly. Hey, Sharon Jarrell. Welcome, everybody. We've got Miss Josie in at a dollar. He is cute. My landlord came, which I had told my landlord. <laughs> when we moved in, he told me no pets. And I told him, I said, now, my son has a cat, and if my son comes to live with us, the cat comes too. So, my son came to live with us, and the cat is here, and the cat's been here. We've been in, in this house nearly three years. So, when he came last month, I told him, I said, I have a dog. I said, he's a little guy. I said, I have my own steam cleaner. So, anyway, so, going once at a dollar for Miss Josie. Going twice at a dollar. Two times. This is your final warning. Final warning. And we're sold to Miss Josie for a dollar. Thank you, Miss Josie. That's the bucket for that. Okay. Guys, this is, I don't know. Okay. Let me get it turned the right way. This has a 17-inch necklace. And then it has matching earrings. And this says, I do not know if they bought this jewelry there or if they put it in the box. Okay? Because this is how I got it. It says, K-R-A-N-I-C-H-S. Craniches. Uh, Al Altoona and State College. So, this came from Pennsylvania. There you go. There's the word. This is red. It is a set. And we're going to start the bidding on it at $4, guys. $4. You have a 17-inch necklace, and then you have matching pierced earrings. $4 is where we're going to start on this. $4. Very nice set. Very pretty. I do feel like these are glass, maybe. I don't feel like they're like a rhinestone. I think they're just glass. Got Cheryl Seaver in at $4. I do want to remind. Oh, I do want to tell you guys that on Wednesday, me and April are going to have a craft sale, but I don't know where. I don't know if it's going to be on my channel or hers. Uh, last month, we had it on my channel, so we may have it over on hers this month. Not sure. So, and I normally don't wear a sleeveless, but it. It's been hot in Arkansas. We've had heat indexes over 100 all, already. So we have Cheryl Seaver in at $4. Cheryl Seaver is in at $4. Go in one time at $4, guys. Got Josie in at 5 now you can't wear yours just like this tomorrow. You have a set just like it. Cool. Why can't you wear it? Oh, your dress. Your dress. So, um, I have shorts on under it. But uh, it comes down to my knees. Cheryl's in at five fifty. I was trying to think, what is she talking about? I thought you were talking about the jewelry. But now, I remember, you have your... Uh, the dress just like it so and doesn't it match the colors of my earrings so good the green and the blue and the green and the blue so yes from dg boutique so we're going one time at five dollars and fifty cents going two times at five dollars and fifty cents final warning final warning and we are sold to cheryl Seaver for Five dollars and fifty cents. Thank you, Miss Cheryl. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So we have a set. Let me 
find my mannequin. Well, not my mannequin, my board. My board. Actually, I don't know that I can get it on the board. We'll try, though. It's... Okay. So, uh... It says... Lead, nickel, and cadmium compliant. Not intended for children under the age of 12. It was made in China. But, I mean, I don't think it just came over yesterday. I think it is, uh, I bought this at the flea market where I have my booth. So, let's just show you. This is what the necklace looks like. And then it has matching earrings in the purple color. And we're going to do a buy it now on these for $3. Buy it now for these uh, for $3. And, uh... A, it looks like a good rinse would have done these good. They they are dusty, so I didn't even notice that they were so dusty. Um, did I fall? No, we've just been going about twenty mu twenty minutes. What do you mean, did I fall? Are you talking about my arm? Dog, the dog scratched me. And the dog bit me there. I don't have no bruises that I see. I do have some, but not. <laughs> not. The dog is. He's a little rough. And he nips. And he nipped me right here. I got one right there. A bruise right there. So, anyway. So, $3. And hey, Vita. And hey, victim of the lag. Vol. So, $3 is the price on this. And uh, your word is going to be purple. Purple is your word. Purple is your word. But no, I did not fall. I haven't fallen in a while. So, purple is your word. I got you, Miss Josie. It's my hair. It's the shadow of my hair. Oh, right here. That red is from me rubbing my eyes from uh, from allergies from my eyes watering. So, no. But there, my hair was causing a shadow on my face. But uh, this red right here is from me rubbing my eyes. My allergies are going good. <clears throat> we went, We went Saturday to the cemetery where John is buried. And decorated the graves, and oh my goodness, my allergies have been going good. What was that? Oh, I picked up the wrong one. That's number four, not number three. Okay, this is number three. Yeah, that that's just me rubbing my eyes. So, but thanks for asking, sweet friend. Okay, this one says something on it. Oh, this one says Monet. On the side of it. There. There's what I'm looking for right there. I have two of these. So we have this kind of a clip on. Can you see that? It's one of those, uh, almost like a lever back clip on it's Monet sign Monet right here on the side of the earring and they are mother of pearl surrounded by rhinestones can you see that pretty mother of pearl surrounded by rhinestones and we're going to start <clears throat> no I haven't fallen uh, we're going to start the bidding on these at three dollars guys Three dollars. Three dollars. Monet. Look, you guys are lucky. Two weeks in a row I've painted my fingernails for y'all. This one is, let's see... 
Rosie Outlook is what it's called, and it's another Sally Hansen one. I like Sally Hansen. We've got Vex and Rose in at three first. Remember, you only need to go up by a quarter. I think everybody that is here has bought from me before. If you've not, you need to send your information to Cindy Loves Jewelry, AR at gmail.com. Tell me your YouTube name, your real name, and your uh, address, and your PayPal address. So we got Bobby Pizzelli in at four. We all need a little rosy outlook. I like this nail polish. It doesn't, it doesn't uh, chip very well. You can't see them. Why can't you see them? You've got Mother of Pearl. Clip-ons. Sign Monet. Hey, Jewelry Unboxing. Welcome to my channel. Vex and Rose says she is out. So, we've got Bobby Bazelli in at four going one time. Bobby Pizzelli in at four going two times. No, I can't pick you up. You go find Bubby or Daddy. Mama can't do it. She's busy. I know. Oh, Daddy's eating. You better go see what he's got. See if he'll share with you. So, oh, it's just too bright. Let's see. Where is my little switch, Jeroni? Mm, I've got everything. There it is. Let's see. There. You can see a little bit more. See that? Okay, going two times at $4. This is your final warning. Final warning. Don't lick my toes. Don't lick my toes. Final warning. And we're sold to Bobby Bazzelli for $4. Thank you, Miss Bobby. Go on, puppy. What do you got? What do you got? Mm. There. Hi, Bon Space. Hi, Myra. How are you? Sorry, guys. So, we're sold to Bobby Pizzelli for $4. Thank you, Miss Bobby. Hey, you need to put that down. That does not belong to you. Listen to me. Look here. Mommy's got the ruler. You put it down. You better go on. You better go on and don't you sass me. He picked that up because he won't, he won't, he'll eat on it. He don't need to eat on it. I don't know if they still have mercury in them or not. <laughs> Tell dad not to let him out. So, hey, Francis. So, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, I have these and I had these last week. And I forgot to get them out of my purse to offer them to y'all. They are so pretty. And uh, I have looked and looked and looked. They are a designer, I am sure. But I don't know who they are. And why I tell you why I think that, if you look on, let's see, let me turn the light off so it's not so bright. If you look on the back, okay, here's the post. And right under it is a little rhinestone chip in it. Like, some of them use it for their, um, yeah, he's teething. He he was chewing on a thermometer. That was why I was trying to get my son in here to get him. Anyway, they have these little rhinestones in the back. And then you have these uh, insets of, um, 
of autumn colors and then this these little rhinestones here these dingle dangle earrings and we're going to start the bidding on these at two dollars two dollars guys they're and they're very well made i don't know who made them but they're very well i kind of think they may be liz claiborne i've seen her put those little chips in some of hers but i do not know that for sure so two dollars is where we're going to start on these two dollars and they are in gold tone gold tone two dollars let's see If I can get them to got yeah, Jen Layton in at two dollars. Jen's in at two dollars on these. Hi, sweet Francis. How are you, darling? Two dollars to Miss Jen going once. Cheryl Sievers in at two fifty. Oh my God, y'all! Three dollars to Jen. Three fifty to Miss Cheryl. Jared took him to my room and shut the door. I can hear him crying all the way in here. Four dollars to Jen. It wouldn't be bad if he didn't try to eat everything around me. Hey, Dave. Are you done eating? Are you done with what you were eating? Cheryl's out. We're going once at four dollars to Miss Jen. Will you get him and hold him? He just wants some attention. Peaches and cottage cheese. Will you get him and hold him? He's in, locked in the bedroom, but he's crying. He don't like to be locked away from his people. Going two times at $4. And sold to Jen for $4. Thank you, Jen. Okay, so um, a friend of mine gave me the name of a place by Jewelry Wholesale, which I've not bought any. But when she gave me it, she told me that camo is in this year. I don't know. But I live in Arkansas, and camo is always in. Okay, so just saying. <laughs> Camo is always in in Arkansas. And I happen to find some camo earrings. Anyway, so we have these teardrop shaped camo earrings. And we're going to start the bidding on these at $2. $2. They are basically brand new. They don't look like they've ever been worn. Someone named Micah with a video. I haven't got any messages about Micah in a video. But if they're coming from me, tell me. So, I don't open videos, and I know that's not nice. But I don't open videos I don't know. I mean, I don't open videos if it, unless it like says uh, that it's somebody's YouTube auction. I will open and see what the address is on it. But, uh, anyway, I'm just real careful about not opening videos because of that. Because you can get viruses. Oh, no. Vita's got it. So, we've got Shell Seaver in it, too. <laughs> Cheryl Seaver is in it, too. Yeah, the last video that came from you, uh, Vita, I did not open because I knew that you had gotten a virus before. So, uh, 
Cheryl Saver going once. Cheryl Seaver going twice at two dollars. And final warning, guys. Final warning. Sold to Cheryl Seaver. Thank you, Cheryl. Now, when we have our craft sale, and I need to message Mary Pelletier about this. When we have our craft sale, um, I have a whole bunch of jewelry stuff, a whole bunch of jewelry crafting stuff. So uh, if you are a jewelry crafter, then you definitely want to. There we go. Okay. Okay. So I'm not. This is brand new in the box. Yep. I'm not going to take it out of the box. It just fell out. It's a Avon butterfly pen. It's from 2004. It is named, let's see, it has a name. Burstone butterfly pen and it says January garnet. Okay. But I mean, it's red. I love red jewelry. So you can wear it. You don't have to be a January baby. And we're going to start this the bidding on this at $2. Two dollars, guys. Two dollars. I haven't hardly got any messages today on Messenger, so two dollars on the butterfly pen. We got Cheryl in at two dollars. You're a January baby. Going one time at two dollars, guys. Going one time at two dollars. Oh yeah, you sent me a video about Barbara Bandrell, and I was gonna go watch that. So because I you know, talk about my. Louise Mandrell. There's Louise. But, uh, uh, yeah, I was going to go watch that. I just haven't had time to sit still. Yesterday was busy. Church day, both times. Dave spoke at church last night. So, going two times at $2. This is the final warning. Yeah, that's not the one you sent me. You didn't send me one about Micah. You sent me one about Barbara Mandrell. So, Sold to Cheryl Seaver for $2. Thank you, Miss Cheryl. Okay, guys. We're going to start these at $4. Now, I normally don't sell. Just sell. Outright sell men's cufflinks. But we have this pair of vintage cufflinks with a... Um... Blue, blue rhinestone, <laughs> the one with no rhythm, I think that one may have been Arlene, hey Darlene, they uh, probably had a tie bar, because there's a place here for a tie bar, but they come in their original box, LaRue cufflinks, and we're going to start these at $4 guys, Four dollars, and I'm looking for my phone, and I will show them to you again. Okay. Okay. Four dollars on the cufflinks, Larue, made in the USA cufflinks. There are no markings on the cufflinks, though. But see here, I think a tie bar was originally in the box. But this is how I got it. So we're going to start at $4, guys. Actually, let's start at 3 3 That way, if you're a reseller, it'll give you a little bit more room. $3. 
Got Cheryl Seaver in at three. They're really pretty. I like that long blue stone, almost like a starburst, except for or a sunburst, except for it's oval and not round. Got Cheryl Seaver in at three. Going one time. The little box is cute too. Shows a little wear, but I mean, it's an old box, so I would expect it to show somewhere. Going two times. See up here, it has a little. You might could go across it in here. Might could go across it with a, a leather. Yeah, my husband is not either. So, going two times. This is your final warning. Final warning. And we are sold for three dollars to Miss Cheryl Seaver. Thank you, Cheryl. Or Mrs. Cheryl Seaver, I should say, not Miss. A bunch of stuff slid up there. Hey, Anna Mora, how are you? Thank you. Thank you for your bid. Okay, this is going to be a buy it now, y'all. Did you go find your monkey? He's back. I couldn't stand here and even cry. Y'all know I'm I'm just a sucker. So anyway, this will fit me. I will tell you that right now. It will fit me and it does fasten. But when I start moving my arms around, it'll pop off open and then that bothers me. So otherwise I would have kept it. It is like it feels like calf hair, only it has a leopard print around it. Uh, I can measure what the diameter is across it. It is uh, before Dale gets home. <laughs> it is two and a half inches across. Your boyfriend isn't either. So, yeah, he he's just he's doing more than tea. He's just he's been real calm all day, and now he wants to get wild. So. Anyway, he's a mess. His his little mama his little mama is a pushover. So, so see the see the little animal print. This is gonna be a bite now at two dollars, two dollars, and the word is going to be animal animal the word is animal got gotcha, you miss bobby pozzelli Bobby beat you, Cheryl. Sorry. It was number nine. Here we go. This is number ten. Okay, guys. My, my stone girls. I might need some help. I do not know what these are. They're black stone chips. They have this little tassel. It's stretch. I don't know. I don't really even remember where I got this, to tell you the truth. But you got a little black stone. He can play with that. That's fine. As long as not yeah, as long as he's not. Now, this one here has kind of got a gray, some little uh, translucence to it. But the rest, well, they're kind of, some of them you can kind of see through them, and some of them you can't. It really needs restrung. It's a little. Anyway, um, we'll do. Um, we'll start on this one at a dollar. Okay, I'm gonna start at a dollar on this one. Shungat, and 
Did you? You didn't send me this, did you? No, I don't think it's Shungite. I bought me a Shungite fish, though, necklace. I've been wearing it, but I don't think that's what it is. I don't know. Got Vita in at a dollar. It's really pretty. It is stones. Yeah, it's a cute little bracelet. Yeah, it could be anything. Or it could be a lot of things. Maybe that's the word we need to use. It could be a lot of things. Could be terminated quartz, tourmaline. Yep. So we've got Vita in at a dollar. Y'all going to let Vita have this for a dollar? We are going once. Agate. I mean, it could be all kinds of things. So. Going once at a dollar. Chips from Mama Earth. <laughs> Yep. Going twice at a dollar. This is your final warning. Final warning. And we're sold to Miss Vita for one dollar. Thank you, Vita. Thank you, sweetums. There we go. There's my... And that, my friends, was the first ten items. We breezed right through those. And we're going to do a giveaway. Uh, they're a little polished, yep. Yeah. Not high polish. So, this ring is a size 8. Um, I'm not real sure where I got this ring. <laughs> I, I really am not. I think it come from Patsy Crafty. I think. But, let's see. I don't want y'all to mix up that I'm giving away my, uh, Celtic green. So we have this right here. You got four little peridots. This is a giveaway. Size 8. And we're picking numbers for this one, guys. So pick a number between 1 and 50 and start. And I will tell you what the giveaway rules are. So, the giveaway rules are, this is not a YouTube giveaway. This is totally me. It's not connected to YouTube in any other way, except for the fact that I'm transmitting through YouTube. Uh, you do not have to be a member of my page, like my page, or uh, follow me, or subscribe, or buy a single solitary to thing to pick a number. You, um, I will ship all over the U.S., and outside of the U.S., I ship all over the world. International shipping does not scare me. And um, let's see, where else? What else? You got to play pretty and play nice. You can only pick one number. Pick it only once. If somebody else above you picked the same number, I'm sorry. There will be another giveaway in 10 more items, okay? Um, do not change your number, okay? Um, let's see. And have fun and no whining. No bickering and whining over who won the ring and who didn't. Okay? So, hey, Frugalicity, you snuck in on me. And there we go. I hope you have finally had a chance to open some of your packages from me and are enjoying them. On your chat, we are doing the number game. Yes, we are doing the number game. Yep. That's your you're right. We are doing the number game. What scares you? Shungat has lines in it. Put you in time out, Barbie. So, anyway, so, everybody got your number in? Get your number in. Because I'm fixing to say stop and reveal the final number. Reveal my, 
secret number. And I, I've, I've started doing this a lot easier where I write the numbers on the back of my cards when I'm making this all up. And so then I don't have to think of a number. Let's see. I'm looking. Barbie's telling me I'm not the boss of her. That's just what she thinks. Ken told me I could boss you around all I wanted to. That he would sit back and watch and laugh. International shipping scares you. It can be scary if you don't know who to use. I don't internationally ship through PayPal because it costs more money. And I sure as heck don't internationally ship through the post office. Have mercy. That's like highway robbery. But if you use pirate ship and get on their program that gives you discounts, which all you have to do is email them, message them, and ask for the international uh, shipping discount. They will give it to you. And where normally something would cost me $14.95 to $15.95 to ship to Canada, a package, uh, I can ship it for $9.95. So he doesn't know anything. He's merely this, oh, bull. That's not right. So anyway, I'm hitting stop. I hope you all got your numbers in. Oh, 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 oh. That is not yours. That is not yours. Come here, little man. Give it to mommy. Give it to mommy. I've got my ruler. Dave, come get this from him. I've got my ruler. I'm going to walk you. I'm going to spank your little booty. And then you're going to cry and be cute. And mama will say, oh, I saw me. Yeah, I'm sorry for threatening you. Give me that little black thing. He stole it. He's a thief. Yeah, you might ought to go play with daddy. He stole my earring thing. So, okay. Okay, where did my prize go? I lost my prize. Where did it go? There it is. Giveaway A. Okay, here's your number. The number is 48. 48. And y'all know I would never hit my puppy. Well, I swat him every once in a while when he bites me real hard, but I would never hit him with that ruler. But he wants my ruler real bad so he can chew on it. He likes to chew on wooden things. So it looks like to me Frugalicity has won at 46. You had another premonition? Listen, Frugalicity has been really lucky. Get, uh, I think he's won the last three weeks giveaway A's. The first giveaways. You won the ring. Frugalicity. So, congrats. You. You better be nice. Nope. I don't trust you, so I'm moving that over there. How does it feel not to be trusted, little man? <laughs> it's just e ESP. Well, see, if you go to Barbie's channel on Tuesday nights when they have their auctions, Ken puts it up to his head and transmits it to us. I won twice last week. Me and Ken were on the same wavelength. <laughs> oh. Okay. Guys, you know that when I pay up, I have to start up. And uh, I paid up. But it's gorgeous. I'll just tell you that right now. It is a gorgeous piece. It is garnets. And it is 14 karat rose gold over sterling silver. And it is a ring. And... I did not write what size it is, so let's just slide her down the mandrel, and it is a size 7. And we will put it on the little ring finger. So, oh, what was the prize? You won a ring. It was a, that uh, Peridot ring. You won that Peridot ring. So, we have these garnets in rose gold. Let's see if we change the color. Ooh, no, that's not good. Let's see if we change the color. Can you see that better? 
Mm, that one shows pretty. Garnet, rose gold, uh, size 7, 14 carat rose gold over sterling silver, okay? 14 carat rose gold over sterling silver. And we're going to start this at $10, guys. We have to start at $10 on this one. Sometimes I see it and it's so pretty I can't not buy it. And so I pay too much. $10 is where we're starting. My Barbie packing slip back there, but that didn't come from Barbie. Nope. Sorry, guys. I don't mean to shove you around. Here we go. There. Size 7. Size 7. There it is. Yeah. I, I did. I paid. I paid way up for for that. Normally, I don't pay that much for something, but anyway. Oh, listen. I was like, I was the other day. I was like, no, today I dumped my ring thing, and I was like, I've got way too many rings. I don't even have that many fingers and toes all added up. So. We've got Judy Daly in at 10, Anna Mora in at 11, Judy's in at 12. Y'all gonna let her have this 14 karat rose gold ring over sterling for $12? You got garnets. Are you a garnet baby? Is that your birthstone? I can't remember. No, your birthstone is opal. Your birthstone is opal. You just like garnets, huh? So we're going one time at eight dollars. Nope. Michelle's in at thirteen. Michelle is in at thirteen first, Mike. Hi, Mike. Mike is in at fifteen. Yes, very pretty. Hey, 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 hey. Shoot, shoot. Here. You get out of there. You have all kinds of toys in here. Your monkeys in here, your Santa hats are in here. Play with your pretties, okay? Judy's in at 16. And welcome, Mike. 300. 300 what? No, I did not pay $300 for it. It is beautiful. But I'll sell some. Oh, I'll sell somebody some pearls for three hundred. Still trying to. I'm still trying to sell those pearls. We have Mike out to Judy Daly. Uh. So. Going one time at sixteen dollars to Judy. Oh, over 300 rings, yeah. She has a bunch. She's kind of the reason I have so many because she enables me. Yep. Going two times at $16 to Miss Judy. Two times at $16. We do have a... Oh, there's my ring back on. We do have several pieces of sterling. This is rose gold over sterling. This is your final warning. Final warning. And we are sold to uh, Judy Daly at $16. Thank you, Judy. Um, I have over 100 rings myself. What's that number? Okay, guys. 
Thanks. Mike is very kind to us. Yes. All right, guys, this one is going to just take a special person that really, really likes big rings. And when I bought it, I did not have any idea that it was this big. And we're starting this one at $2. $2. And I'm going to tell you what size it is right now. It is a size 8. And this is a simulated emerald. And um, let me just, yeah. So, here we go. Y'all see that? Start at $2, guys. It's really pretty. If you look at it just like this, it's real pretty. But when you look up like that and you see how high it sits up, you're just like, really? $2. It is $8. It is eight size 8. Size 8. Got Anamora in it too. Anamora is in it too. We can't. We can't do this. That's a door knocker. Man, you could knock somebody out with it. <laughs> Anamora is in at $2. It cracks me up too. And I really cannot, I don't know what I was thinking when I bought it. I don't think I even dreamed that it was this big is really what I think. It's a, uh, it is a simulated emerald, a simulated emerald. What are you cooking, Darlene? We had a, Fried cabbage with uh, smoked sausages and cornbread. And then I had fruit for dessert. Going once at $2. Yep, simulated emerald. In other words, it's glass. Going twice at $2. Size 8. And it's, uh, let me just look again. It is not, it's just silver tone. It is not, uh, and we're sold for $2 to Anamora. Thank you, Anamora. You will definitely make a statement with that. Puppy, you got to go play. Go play. Number 13. You'll have to send me a picture of you wearing it, okay? These are cute. <clears throat> We're going to start these little babies at Buffalo Wings and Baked Parmesan Zucchini. That sounds good. I'm in the mood for zucchini. I'm gonna have to go to the, oh I gotta go to the store tomorrow. Get some milk. So I might get me some zucchini. Uh these little earrings, we're gonna start at a dollar, guys. Start at one dollar. They are just silver tone, lacy with a little blue stone. Come here. Come on. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on. No, we're not playing. No. Okay. I'll talk to you, Vita. I'll help you sell it. Sounds like the cats are fighting out there. Start at a dollar, guys. Or give me a pass. Hey, Denise. Come here, buddy. Come on. Come on. Got Cheryl Seaver in at a dollar. Cheryl Seaver in at a dollar going once. Cheryl Seaver in at a dollar going twice. Can't decide if it's the dogs howlings or if it's 
cats howling out there. I think it's cats fighting. Going twice. This is your final warning. And sold to Cheryl Seaver for a dollar. I know. I saw him. I saw that. So we're all being very good. So thank you, Miss Cheryl. What was that, number 13? Oh, this one is very, very interesting. This ring, it is very cool. It is a, I believe it's a size 8 also. Because I kind of thought about buying it to keep for myself. And then when it came in, I decided, I don't know if I would wear it a whole lot or not. So, nope. Yep, it's a size 8. But I'm going to put it on and show you what's cool about it. It's a spinner ring. See, it spins around. You got these purple simulated stones in this part. Oh, yay. So, in this part, it just spins around. So, it start at $4, size 8. And it's just a blue, I mean, a purple simulated stone. But it's really cute. And let's see if it's in stainless. Nope. Just in silver tone. It's a motion spinner ring. Start at $4, guys. It's cute. I love watching it spin. If You put it on your hand and it spins a lot more. But let's see. These little things out here just spin around. We'll start it at three, guys. If you anybody's interested, three dollars at size eight. It is pretty. Start at three dollars. Got Anamora in it, three. Anamora is in it, three. And I just got that video you guys were talking about. I just got it in a email, in a message. So I'll go through later and delete it. You can delete those from your messenger if you, if you open... Open it in Messenger. They there will be three little dots beside it. Shell Saver is in it four. I mean three fifty. I'm sorry. Sitting there looking at that, reading it and saying four. Three fifty. Listen, I've got to start doing something and right now what I'm working on is watching my portion control. And Amore's in it three seventy five. Um I fixed the battery in my scale, and I wish I hadn't have. So, yeah, I wish I hadn't have. Cheryl's in it for... I love five... I love watching my puppy when he cocks his head at sounds. Dave is watching wrestling in there. Um, the one I got came from Blandine, which I'm sure she isn't sending them on purpose. But a lot of times when you get a virus like that, it'll message all of your friends. And so maybe one of her friends got it and it sent it and then it messages their friends. So, But if you don't open it and you just delete it, it'll be fine. The dust on yours weighs two pounds. The dust on your what? On your scale. Oh, 
Listen, I wish I hadn't fixed mine. So, got Anamora in at five. Anamora is in at five. Anyway, I've gained 25 pounds since January, since I was at the doctor in January. That is why I've been feeling bad, because I don't need to carry 25 extra pounds around. So, we're watching, watching portions right now, trying to eat a lot more healthy, like fresh fruit, stuff like that. That was 14, 15. Okay, Cheryl says she's out. Going what? To Anamora. Going twice to Anamora. This is your final warning. Hey, Angie. And we're sold to Anamora for $5. Thank you, Miss Anamora. Okay, guys, this is a vintage set I bought from April. And uh, I think I've offered it before, but I don't remember. It hasn't had a number on it, but I don't remember ever offering it. So, if I did, I'm offering it again. I'm, I'm thinking I put a number on it and then decided I was going to put it on Etsy and then, yeah. So, okay. So, we have, hey, Joellen. Welcome. And I have your information, so you are welcome to bid. So we have this bracelet. These are light green and um, kind of a brownish color. So you have a bracelet. It has a fold over clasp. You have a necklace. And you have matching earrings that the earrings are screw backs. They are not. None of it's signed. So the necklace is like that. It's a choker style. I hear you, puppy. Everybody hears you being a whiny baby. Yes, you're being a whiny baby. And nobody likes a whiny baby. No. No, mommy don't like it when you whine. Nope, nope, nope. Mommy don't like it. There's what the earrings look like. They are screw backs. What? Why are you whining? Because you want your mama to hold you so you can take a nap. But then mama can't work. Oh, you're going to sass? Are you sassing me? Right here on TV and everything? You're going to be sassy? I know y'all probably think that crazy woman talking to that dog like that. But don't tell me you don't talk to your dogs, okay? <laughs> so, anyway. So, we have this beautiful rhinestone set. You have the earrings. Three pieces. And then you have the bracelet, okay? We're going to start this set at four dollars guys four dollars uh, we talked to the cat too but usually we don't talk to the cat that nice <laughs> the cat usually gets called spawn of satan he's horrible the dog can walk by and just look at the cat and he gets slapped so hey perlini got cheryl in at four dollars have Cheryl in at four dollars. Barbie's back. Joe Ellen is in at five. I took the bracelet down so it didn't fall. No, you can't bite my ring. Well, I will be in trouble when he learns how to jump into my lap. Right now, he hasn't learned that.
but he has learned how to jump up on the bench and into the bed. But when he learns how to jump in my lap, I will have, it'll be a fight to keep him down because he's just like, he melts down when he wants me. He just, he needs his mama time. Come on. Come on. Come on. You got to Come on. Come on, mama can't. Mama can't get you if you're over there. Come on. Okay. Cheryl's in at eight. Cheryl is in at eight. Joe Ellen is out. We're going one time at eight dollars. It's a beautiful set. Going two times at eight dollars. This is your final warning. Thank you both for bidding. I appreciate you both. And we are sold to Cheryl Seaver for $8. Number 15. Um, brown rhinestone set. Okay, guys. Are my earring people here? I have an earring lot. Number 16 earring lot. There are 10 pairs of earrings in this. We always start at $5 on 10 pairs, okay? $5 is the starting bid on this. $5. So, let's see. I have... There it is. Um... Let me see. There it is. I don't know what that is, but I think it says something on the back of it. Let's see. You're trying to you're kind of busy trying to decide if what. Okay. I thought it said something, but it doesn't. So you have this black rope with little black rhinestones with a big faceted black um, piece. I think it's plastic in the middle. Okay, so that's pair number one. Then you have these, pair number two. Is a... Uh, is uh, Darlene still here? She'll recognize where these came from just be because of the way they're fastened together. And it's been a while since I got a lot from you, Miss Darlene, but they're fastened with a button. Pair number three. And some of these are in baggies and some of them are not. Thank you. Uh, this came from DG Boutique. Barbie and I are very fond of shopping there at DG Boutique. And she enables me and tells me when they're having sales. have these little yellow squares. Fish wires. Hey, Lena. How are you, hon? Oh, I'm glad that you liked it all. We have these antique Goldie uh, triangles. They're textured. And uh, they are on fish hooks, fish wires, whatever. Shepherd's hook, not shepherd's hook, uh, French wires. I always call them fish hooks. And I thought that I was just making that up. And then I was looking at some jewelry on a website. Uh, and uh, they refer to them as fish hooks too. So... Then I knew I wasn't just making it up. <laughs> and then we have some little, uh, they're just, a, you can't see that. I don't know why I'm even trying to do that. So they're little gold and they're little, uh, just little rectangles. And you could, I guess, have them monogrammed if you wanted. Or you could just wear them like that. They're posts. These are all gold tone. I do, I've done so many silver tone. I don't have enough for silver tone anymore. 
I didn't have enough silver tone to do silver tone. Then you have these little, uh, this is pale pink. This drop is pale pink. Always love hearing that people got things and that they loved it. That they really liked it. It, it always makes me feel like I did good. That I've done something good because you liked your things that you bought from me. So, I'm putting, if you're wondering what I'm doing, I'm putting backs. Because I don't like to send them out without backs on post. And uh, those did not have backs on them, so... So those are pale, pale pink dingle dangles with a little uh, gold ball post and then the little pearl, uh, the little rhinestone dingle dangles. So I'm looking for a $5 starting bid. We have these. They are a nice orangey peachy color in a nice shepherd's hook. I sold some skull jewelry to Bob a couple of weeks ago. I said, got $5 to Joe Ellen. We have these nice. These are uh, gold and silver tone clips, vintage. They have some wear on the back, but the front of them are very nice. I always try to tell you if there's any wear. So. And we have a pair of bubble earrings. Thanks, Denise. Got Vexen in at five and a quarter. Joe Ellen's in at six and a pair of green bubble earrings. So, we're going to put them all back in the bag and count them. So, green bubbles, number one, because I want to make sure that there's ten pair in here. Green bubbles, number one. Okay, Cheryl, thanks. Uh, Clip-ons, number two. Pink dangles, number three. Gold triangles, number four. Little post ones, number five. Yellow dingle dangles, number six. Black and tri gold triangles, number seven. And number eight, these rope. Number nine, these rope and black. And number ten, these right here, these orange ones. Got the, so we have Joe Ellen in at six. Uh, Vex and Rose says she's out. So we're going once at six dollars. Going twice at six dollars. Cool. Going three times at six. Oops, Glam Kitty's in at six fifty. Hey, Bob, welcome, sweetie. Got Glam Kitty in at six fifty. Joe Ellen is out. Going once at six fifty. Going two times at six fifty. This is your final warning. Final warning. And we are sold to Glam Kitty for six dollars and fifty cents. Thank you, Bob. Yeah. Hey, look, guys. Look what I have. I bought me a picker upper. And it works pretty good, even if it was only a dollar. Of course, I have to be able to see what I'm doing to pick it up. But I dropped my eyeball here, and it don't want to come up. There we go. And it's my favorite eyeball. I have several eyeballs, but that one is my favorite. Okay. And, of course, I pulled up a bunch of silver ribbon with it. And 
if I put it back down there, you know who's under my feet just waiting for it. So, we got Bob for the earrings. Okay. Now. Uh, wow, that's a nice chain. Hmm, I'll have to look it over. It pulled up a chain. Uh, part of it's magnetic, though. Okay. We're looking, 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 looking. <laughs> yeah, I'm only five, two and a half. These are, this came from the Dollar Tree, so it's nothing spectacular. It probably, if it lasts a month, I'll have my dollar juice out of it. I've done got my dollar juice out of it. I've just picked up several things. So, this is a brooch lot, but it also has brooches and scarf clips. So, and we have name, name brands, okay? So, this one here is very interesting in that it is a scarf clip. And can you see that? Some kind of shell of something, of some kind. It looks like abalone to me. Mmm, mmm. Ow, you got me good. Go on. Oh, did he get me? His little nail broke off in my skin. Go on. You're hurting me. Please. Ouch, that hurt. And it's got a little pin on the back of it. So, we, there's 10 brooches. There are name brands in here. And we're going to start these 10 brooches at $6, okay? That's where we're starting. This one here is Abalone Scarf Clip. Then here is another scarf clip that is just designs. All kinds of, it's just swirlies. It's not na nobody's name or anything. It's just swirlies. Come here. Come here. Come here. Okay. This one here is really pretty. I love this. This is also a scarf clip, and you can see that. See how that's cut in that metal? Isn't that pretty? I'm showing all the scarf clips first. So, there's four scarf clips. And then you have this hammered one right here. So, now we're going to go into the brooches. Okay. So, um, just make sure on my names. This one here is an Avon brooch. Really pretty Avon brooch. This one here is... Trafari, but not crown Trafari, just Trafari. It's just a squiggly line. This one here is not signed. And it's a squiggly line looking thing. This one here is really pretty. And it is, oh, I didn't realize that's what this was. This is JBK, which is Jacqueline Bouvier Kennedy. And it is a flag pin, and it's made in the USA. This one here is... Not signed, but I think, I'm not positive if it's one of the, um, this one is an a H, H, lay down on your dress, Bubby, lay down on your dress and rest, and this one is signed, and it is another Trafari, I believe, Trafari, yes, this one is Trafari also, and it's, I don't know that it's supposed to be an S, but it looks like an S only, um, yeah, 
Looks like an S. So I'm five, two and a half. And a half. Notice the half. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Six brooches, four scarf clips, and uh, the bid is at six dollars. Opening bid was six dollars, and we have Vex and Rose in at six, and we have an Avon, two Trafaris, and a uh, yeah, she's already in at six, so you have to go above six, okay? She's already in at six. So, um, an Avon, two Trafaris, and a JBK, which is Jack, Jacqueline Bouvier Kennedy. And it's this beautiful brooch right here. So, we have six brooches and four nice spark uh, clips. Only this one actually is a brooch and a clip so so let's see we've got seven to barbie frugalicity's in it seven and a quarter barbie's in it eight uh frugalicity came in at 851st vexen so vexen came in at nine frugalicity's in at 950 that jbk there one it probably sells for no telling what. I have some JBK jewelry listed and it goes for good prices. Camrose and Cross, yeah, Camrose and Cross is who makes the JBK brooch, and uh, here's one listed for $40 on Posh, so, yeah. Actually, I'm going to put it, since it is a uh, rhinestone one, I'm going to put it in its own bag inside of it. So, we have Vex and Rose in at 11. Yep, there's one listed for $40 on Posh. Uh, the Trafari ones. Yep, I think you would do very well with your money here. Jude's in at 12. Will you settle down up here? Did you hurt your little fingernail when you broke it in mommy's leg? Come on. Come on. You got to come on. If you're coming, you got to come on. There you go. Jude's in at 14. Vexing is out. Frugalicity, are you out or in? Now, you've got to be a good boy if you're going to be up here. Because you can't help mommy sell jewelry. Look here. Look here. In you go. In you go. There you go. Frugalicity is out. So, going one time at $14. Going two times at fourteen dollars. He is getting big. No. You know mama don't like licked in the face. Going two times at fourteen dollars. Final warning. He is a pretty boy.
and sold to Miss Jude. Thank you, Jude. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, guys. We're going to start at $8. This guy is new. It is sterling silver. And I did not have a sterling silver chain to put it on. But it is so pretty. Let's see if we can find a... Yeah, that'll work. I'm looking for a, a pen to stick through to show. Thank you, Jude. Thanks to everybody who uh, who bid there. So, yeah. Looking for something long. That will work. That will work. Now look, mister. You and I will come to fisticuffs if you bite on me and chew on what I'm doing. Let's see. Trying to. So we have a sterling silver cross. There you go. Lay your little head over and rest. There you go. Can you see that? Isn't that pretty? And we're going to start at $8. And it is sterling silver. It is gorgeous. And I will measure it and tell you how big it is. From the top of the bell down, it is an inch and a half long. It weighs 1.7 grams for silver weight. So, got Francis in at eight. Would you lay your head down here and rest? Yeah, there you go. That's Mama's bud. And that's all it takes to calm him down is just to get up on his mama and lay. Just makes him happy. I don't even think my kids calmed down that much when they were little, when mama had them. There you go. Can you, there. There you go. That's a good boy. So, $8 with Francis going once. On this beautiful sterling silver cross, $8 with Francis going twice. Everybody done? Francis going to get the sterling silver cross. She's getting a bargain. And we're sold for $8 to Francis. Thank you, Francis. Thank you, thank you. Hmm. Gonna hurt. Uh oh. Daddy's wrestling is talking naughty. They need their mouth washed out with soap. No faith. So, if you were watching, um, let's see, let me think. Painting the Roses Red, Becky and, uh, Susan Ironside a couple weeks ago, I won these earrings on her channel, <clears throat> and, uh, and I actually bought the earrings for a pair of Sarah Kevin. There were three pairs of earrings in a lot, and I bought them for the Sarah Kevin trees, and these here, and I know y'all going to just fall over, and as my granny used to say, you're going to flitter and fall back in it, but anyway, that's kind of gross, but anyway, these are Coro. Coro, Aurora Borealis clip-on earrings. They are signed Coro. And I had this beautiful little necklace that matched them just perfect. And it was just laying on my desk. And so I'm going to sell these as a set. They are the same Aurora Borealis. The necklace is not signed. The earrings are signed Coro. And we're going to start this set at $5. This Aurora Borealis set at $5, guys. 
and you're talking about vintage and you're talking about coro starting at five dollars is there a copyright symbol next to the coro no there is not no copyright symbol next to it No, no copyright symbol next to it. Got Vex and Rosie in at five. Yep, very vintage. 1940s, that's about 80 years old, guys. These earrings are in immaculate condition for that. Got age goodness in at 550. Vexing is in at six. Age goodness is in at 650. Let me just show you the back of these. Look how nice the back of that is. <clears throat> Can you see? I mean, you would never know that they are this aged. Just beautiful. Okay. If you're going to be up here, you're going to have to be calm. One spoiled puppy. I don't know who done this, but somebody did it at my house. Got Vex and Rose in at 750. The uh, that has a barrel clasp. Francis is in at seven seventy five. It's a beautiful set. Vexing it out. Angela, are you out or are you in? I love A B. You just shine it in the light and it just sparkles and catches that rainbow. Going once. At eight, I mean, no, at seven seventy five. Going twice at seven seven. Oh, Joellen's in at eight. Joellen is in at eight. Uh, Denise, Joellen beat you at eight. You only have to go up. Yep. Francis is in at nine. Your bid only has to go up by a quarter and at the minimum. Joellen's in at ten. Such a good boy. This is when I'm this is why he's spoiled because I enjoy when he's being sweet like this and I just can sit and pet on him and love on him and not have to avoid little snappy teeth because he's teething. I do have a growth, but it's a cute one, Susan Gill. It's a cute little growth. $11. Joe Ellen says she's out. Denise, are you done? We're going once at $11. Going twice at $11. This is your final warning, guys. Final warning. It's 
Sold for eleven dollars to Francis. Are you lagging real bad? I'm sorry. So I would tell y'all funny stories. So this afternoon, Jared asked asked the rascal, was he gonna go on the auction and get auctioned off? And I said, okay, first of all, he can't be auctioned off. He is mommy's baby. And second of all, he has to go on the auction and see all of his fans because he has a fan club. <laughs> Jared rolled his eyes at me. But what do I expect? He's 27 years old. He rolls his eyes at nearly everything I say. So we have a vintage, uh, I, the, I call this necklace flyer pyre. I don't know what you want to call it, but I call it flyer pyre. We're looking at... 12 inches long with, no, let's see, there's 12, okay, 12, 13 inches with, to the first, and with a four, 17 and a half inches total, okay, 17 inches is as long as you could make it, so, Oh, that's sweet. That's sweet. You enjoy your visit. So I just this is this is so sixties and seventies to me, and it is so cool. This is like groovy, dude. I'm sorry. So you have these little plastic, probably um, loose side. Okay. I'm sorry, I keep blowing in your ear, don't I? No missing rhinestones. Super sweet little necklace choker. 17 and a half inches total length. In yellow and orange. Two different colors. Really yellow, orange, and green. Real 60s, real vintagey. Uh, we're going to start the bidding on this at $4, guys. $4. Isn't it cute? Wish I had some cute earrings to go with it. This came from Pennsylvania. From my friend in Pennsylvania. $4 on the little nice Lucite Power necklace. Except for I keep talking and getting in his ears. So, got Susan Gill in it for. Susan came in first, Vita. This is, I, I just call this flower power. His ears are so soft. Okay, we have Susan in at four. Vita, are you coming in? Vita's in at four fifty. Susan's back in at five. I think I need to get me one of those baby wraps and just wear it and wrap him up because he's getting a little big to go down my shirt. So Vita's out, going one time at five dollars. Going two times at five dollars. It is groovy, isn't it? And sold to Susan Gill for five dollars. When I was a teenager in the 70s, I remember girls wearing stuff like this, so. This one is cool. Oh, it's yeah. Me and Barbie have a dress just like just alike like this. Only uh I'm a uh, because I'm pulling him, I've got him in it, it's pulling and pulling over on my sleeveless. Um let me see how long it is. I hear you. 
I hear what you're smack talking at me, Barbie. Oh, you know what? That was number 20. Y'all are just letting me just go along. Let's do a giveaway. That was number 20. Giveaway time. <laughs> giveaway time. Pick a number between 1 and 50 and start. This one is giveaway B. It is for a $2 discount off of your total. If you do not buy anything, if you send me your uh, PayPal address, I will send you $2 on PayPal. Yep. That's what I've decided to do. Start doing that. If if they don't buy, then I'll just give them their money on, the, on that. So, that way you don't lose it. So, I got that uh, idea from Miss Angela Irene. Look, you see what he just done? Tucked his little nose up in there. So, they all think you're very sweet, rascal, rascal. They think you're being very cute. Somebody's messaging me. <laughs> I'll have to add that to my profile anyway I, I started in telling y'all this a while ago my landlord came today and picked up the my rent check he always comes and picks up the rent check and that, technically he's not my landlord his son is my landlord he comes and picks it up and then puts it in his son's bank account for him his son lives off. Let's see. 15, 30 inches. I'm trying to. Anyway, and so Rascal came out. He had never seen him. And he's like, oh, what a cute little puppy. He is a cutie. Yeah. He helps with my anxiety levels very much. It was so pretty this weekend. We went and decorated the graves and we decorated John's grave and my in laws and all that. I got a little bit of sun, but you can't tell there. So, anyway, I'm getting that ready for next. So, everybody got your number in? Remember, if somebody picks it ahead of you, they win. So, you can only pick the pick one number. You don't, uh, yeah, you don't, uh, can't pick again, okay? So, you're only allowed to pick one number. If somebody else picks that number, there'll be another giveaway. Just remember that. So, I have five giveaways tonight. This one is for a $2 discount giveaway B, $2 discount. Yeah, that's okay. You can't change your numbers, Joelle, and Jude was in first with hers. So, you're not allowed to change your number, and Jude was in first with hers. So, whoever's in first is the one that I count. And there will just be another giveaway and they'll be able to get in there. So, are we are we finished? Yep. We're going to put in stop. B. $2 discount or giveaway. <laughs> And the number was 13, and Jude and Bob both had it. But Jude was in first, so Jude wins $2 discount. But there will be more. Yep, tough love. I learned that from Barbie. See, I am still teachable at my old age. You can't teach this old dog new tricks. So, we have a... Um, 
really cool mesh necklace with these shell rings in gold tone. And uh, it is 30 inches long with a two and a half inch extender. And we're going to start the bidding on this at $3. You was only one over, so you should win. Yeah, but she was right on it. So tonight she was right on it. Every once in a while I do the one overs. I have the one over. So so we have all of these. It's officially called the Suck It Up Buttercup Rule. Yes, indeed. So $3 is where we are on this. You do have mesh. I don't see a name brand. I will tell you that the the chain and latch were very, very worn, so I replaced them because they were just so worn. It was all like, it was like, uh, you could tell. So $3, guys. Anybody interested? It's a really nice mesh chain. You're you're still on the semi tough love rules. Okay, we'll do a three dollar buy it now if anybody wants it. Three dollars we'll buy it now. Your word is gonna be shell because it's got orange shell on it. Three dollars we'll buy it now. Otherwise, I'm putting it away. Nobody? Okay. Oh, I got you, Frugalicity. Okay, I got you. Uh, is Robin Skywatch still here? She was here earlier, wasn't she? Yeah. She's not going to be happy that she left if she watches this later. We're going to start the bidding on this at... We're going to start at $4, guys, on this. It is really cool. You have cloth cord wrapped around seed beads and peacock colors. And then you have this little uh, brass colored owl in purple. And starting at $4 on the bidding. Let me tell you how long the necklace is. He is adorable. Got Susan Gill in at four dollars. He is seventeen inches long, um, with a two-inch extender. Two-inch extender. Hey, Autumn Grace, how are you, sweetie? Got Susan Gill in at four on this really cute owl. Really, really cute. Make sure my numbers are right. Yep. Hey, CCC. How are you? We're bidding on this owl. We have Susan Gill in at $4. And we have a napping puppy. We got four dollars to Susan Gill.
I love how soft his ears are. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Drinking tea. Barbie, I've not had a soda pop in. I don't remember the last time I had a soda pop. It's been over a week. Yeah, they're not scarred up. <laughs> oh, the last time I had a soda pop was last Tuesday night when I was drinking that low sodium root beer. That's the last time I've had a soda pop. Hey, Boosh. So, going once at $4, guys. Going one time at $4. Going two times at $4. Final warning, final warning. And we are sold to Miss Susan Gill for $4. Susan Gill, there you go. Thank you. This one is fun. You love those frozen mugs? Okay, we have three pairs of... Oh, dad gum it. Okay, we have three pairs of plastic earrings. Okay. I don't know if they're loose side. I don't know. They're just three pairs of plastic earrings. Oh, I don't, I don't do, if I drink pop, it's full sugar pop. I don't drink diet drinks. Diet drinks are one of my major triggers for migraines, so I don't do diet drinks at all. The only really kind of artificial sweetener I can use without triggering a migraine is sweet and low. And I only put it in my coffee, but I don't drink coffee very much. Okay, guys, this pair right here. Has a missing rhinestone, but I will replace it before I ship it, okay? So, we're going to start the bidding on these three pairs of earrings. Orange shell necklace. No, she did not. You're lagging, Francis. Uh, the orange shell necklace frugalicity one. Susan Gill won $4 on the owl. So, so, you've got these that are kind of uh, a brown, but they're missing a rhinestone, and I will replace that rhinestone for you. You've got the white and the black. And these are going to be a, um, we're going to start the bidding on these at a dollar, a dollar. One dollar. They all have stoppers on them. These have the little rubber stoppers on them. Start at a dollar, guys. Trying to see which one of his little nails he broke off in my skin. Maybe that one. Okay, I'm not seeing any interest, so I'm going to pass on them. Oops, there's Glam Kitty in at a dollar. Got Glam Kitty in at a dollar. Going once. Going twice.
and sold to Bob for a dollar. Thank you, Bob. And I will fix that one earring that's missing a rhinestone, okay? I'm going to lay it here and write fix. Fix. No, that won't write with that. Where's my black one? Fix. Fix. There we go. Sold to Bob for a dollar. Was number 23. Okay. Number 24. Okay, guys. These, this is a bypass ring. It is a size 7. It is brand new. was originally $9.99 at Target. And it has a clearance price. Price of four ninety eight on it, four ninety eight, and I'm going to do a buy it now on this for two dollars and fifty cents. If you want this size seven bypass ring for two dollars and fifty cents, that's half of the clearance price. I'm going to uh, all I need you to type in is bypass bypass. $2.50. It's brand new. Originally was $9.99 from at Target. It was clearance down to $4.98. Bypass is your word. Size 7. Gotcha, Vita. Gotcha, gotcha. Next up is a necklace that I've been sitting on for a long time. I know I've had it over a year. I had it up in my silver drawer. And you're going to say, why did you have it in your silver drawer? It's not silver. You're right. It's not silver. But it is a vintage necklace. And it is really cool. And I will show you what it looks like. Let me just measure it. It is... 19 inches long. Oops. And I hope that the inside of this, it is a confetti loose side on the inside. and uh, But it is in opal colors. Almost looks like an opal in it. But it is confetti loose side. And I'm going to hit the light here and see if you can see it better with the light off. There you go. You can really see that. And we're going to start... The bidding on this at three dollars. Three dollars. That is so pretty. Three dollars, guys. See that confetti loose side in there? Three dollars. Okay. Got frugalicity in at three first. Yeah, you tied her down. Yeah, you did. Three fifty. He's so rotten, is what his problem is. Oh, my gosh. Got Barbie in at three fifty, frugalicity's in at three seventy five. It really does have the look of an opal, but when you really look at it, you can tell that it is a confetti lucite. But it is old. It is riveted on the back. Barbie's in it four. I found out when his birthday is. He was born on March the 5th. This week he will be 14 weeks old. Francis is in it five. 
There is no name brand to it, but it's just so pretty. See, it's got a rivet there in the back. Now, none of us are as young as we used to be. My son just turned 27, and I was 28 when he was born. Well, I turned 28 right after he was born, I should say. Frugalicity's out. Except for Barbie, she keeps getting younger every year. I'm going to text Mel and tell her that she needs to teach Parker how to call you Granny. Ain't nothing that can make you feel old as quick as some little kid calling you Granny. My mom was in her 30s the first time she got called Granny. Well, my mom was actually in her 30s when she first became a Granny. But she was in her early 30s, like 31. And this little kid, uh, this little kid that my mom babysat started calling her Granny. And my dad thought it was hilarious and he made fun of her. Till my mom said, if I'm Granny, you're Pep. Your papa, so anyway, so you're a grandmother. No, we're going to teach him to call you Granny. Granny. Then we'll see if you stay 39 years old. Let's see. Uh, Barbie, are you in or out? Francis is in at $5. Do you know if Barbie's in or out? Frugalicity has said that he is out. We're going once at $5, guys. Going one time at $5. Barbie's out. Going twice at $5. This is your final warning. You're 16, Vita. Hey, Glenna. No, she wasn't 31 at a, she wasn't a grandmother at 31. She babysat this little girl and this little girl called her granny. She was about 31 or 32. We're sold to Francis, but mom was one in 65. My mom became a grandmother at 41, at 41. And my dad was actually still 39 when he be first became a grandfather. But then he turned 40 later that year. Yeah. Sold to Francis for $5. Thank you. Yeah. So my brother got married the first time in 85 and had his first child in 86. And then, uh, and my mom was born in 45, so she was 41. And my dad was born in 46, so he turned 40 the year after, I mean, at the end of the month after my nephew was born. My nephew was born in August, and my dad turned 40 in, at the end of August, so. Okay, guys. We are moving along. Hey, Glenna, welcome. So, this is a set that I made. And we're going to start this set at $8. And you're saying, wow, Cindy, you think a lot of what you make. Uh, this has a lot of natural stone in it, okay? So, it has agates and labradorite. And let me see. And it has these big old shells. And Barbie's going to recognize these big old shells. I told you I had plans for them. So, let's see. How long is this necklace? Didn't even measure it. We're looking at 24. 24. Probably about 26 inches. Hey, Mary Pellet's here. Hey, Mary, we are having a, we are having a craft sale this week. Booge, are we doing that on your channel or on my channel? So we have uh, agate and we have labradorite in this. Okay, we have labradorite chips and agate beads. Oops. So we have uh, 
on your channel. Okay, it will be on Bougie's channel on Wednesday. Sorry, I've got to get everything just right because otherwise it don't make sense. So, we we'll start at $8 on this. You have a 26 inch necklace. You have Labradorite chips and you have agate. And you have shell. And there we go. I'm just hooking it where it Okay, come on. There we go. There. Okay, there you go. And let's just see if we can turn the light back on. Yeah, that's fine. Two Eastern, one my time. So, okay, so there we go. You have a 26 inch chain, it just wants to be obstinate today. There we go. 26 inch. You have this this shell. You have agate beads with labradorite chips. And then you have some copper glass, copper colored glass beads and earrings. And we're going to start at $8 on this set. And yes, I made this set. Eight dollars on this. Earrings and necklace. And you really probably, if you're buying it to wear yourself, you really need to be somebody that can get bougie in at eight. That can really pull off the style. Booze in at eight. Anybody else want to go 850 or eight and a quarter? Anybody going once? Going twice? Those shells are really cool. You could always take the shell off and still have your set just like this without the shells and use the shells for something else. The shells were with uh, some uh, uh, Fleur de Lee necklace uh, set and I took them off. So, oh good, I'm glad. So... And we're sold to Bougie for $8. Sold to Bougie for $8. Thank you, Boo. Send them to Francis. Okay. Francis, they are a gift to you from Miss Bougie. Thank you guys. I appreciate you so much. <laughs> mesh, mesh. What a mesh I am. Yes, I'm selling mesh. Have this really nice mesh necklace, layer and necklace. 
We're going to do a buy it now at $3. Three dollars, and we the word is mesh. If you want this for three dollars, your word is mesh. Mesh, and I will tell you how long this mesh is. This mesh is twenty four. 30 at the inside, and then this outer one is about 30, probably 36. Got you, Miss Judy Daly. Oh. Bub, you're just falling out all over the place. He just flops his head back like he has no worries in the world, and he has no neck bone. Got Judy Daly in it, Mesh. That's sweet. I have another ring that came from <laughs> that came from Target. This one is a size nine, and uh, it was marked down. It was originally nine ninety nine, marked down to four ninety eight, also. And it is a rhinestone, this rectangular color rhinestone. Are you okay, puppy? Don't start snoring on me. Here, put your head over there. There you go. Mom don't like your neck flopping back like that. And this one's going to be a buy it now at $2.50. And uh, shiny is your word. Shiny is your word. Size 9. Size 9. Shiny is your word. Shiny is your word. Originally a $9.99 ring. Still... Got you, Frugalicity. Frugalicity came in first. Okay, we're going to start the bidding on this necklace at $3. $3. And this one is a rose quartz necklace. Pink rose quartz. And uh, this is very similar to a necklace that I had before that I sold to Susan Gill. But her, the one that I sold to her had two strands in it. And this one is a single strand. And you've got little rose quartz here. And then you've got what looks like to be some other kind of quartz material in it. And then these little metal uh, tubular beads. And little pink rose quartz beads down here. And you're looking at about... Um, About 30 inches with 3 inch extender. So about 33 inches. And we're going to start the bidding on this at $3 guys. $3. And these are rose quartz beads. They're not glass. They're stone beads. $3 is where we're starting. Got frugalicity in it. Three. It is in gold tone, guys. Gold tone. I believe this is one that I got from Jude when I bought the big lot from Jude. In fact, I'm positive it is. Frugalicity's in it. Three first.
He just sighed at me. If he was in a wrestling match, he would have done been counted out. Vito, you in or you out? Got three dollars going once. Three dollars going twice. Vita's in at three and a quarter. Susan Gill is in at four. Puppy, you just flop around. It's like a little rag doll. He just flops around. And that's why I need to get him a little little baby wrap. Frugalicity's out. Vita's out. Going one time at $4, guys. Going two times at $4. This is your final warning. Final warning. And we are sold. To Susan Gill for four dollars. Thank you, Miss Susan. These are cute, brand new, occasionally made. They do not have a price tag on them. Uh, I actually look, you can go to occasionallymade.com. I looked them up. Their earrings sell for a goody, pr pretty good price. And we're going to start the bidding on these at $3. $3, guys. Occasionallymade.com if you want to go look. See for yourself what their stuff goes for. But... Got Barbie in at three. Are you starting to wake up, Bubby? Thought I saw eyes. Barbie's in at three. Occasionally made.com. They make wholesale gifts and accessories. I love them too. They're cute. They sell them on Amazon, too, Occasionally Made. Occasionally Made also does, they do mugs and stuff. They're a, like a gift wholesaler. So, going once at eight at $3. Going twice at $3. Oh. Sold to Barbie for $3. He don't like that. We won't do that again. He was not appreciative of that. Oh, him not happy that I woke him up. Him says, do I need to eat some jewelry? Okay, guys, that was number 30. Y'all ready for another giveaway? How about let's give away some free shipping. Free shipping. Enter a number 1 to 50 and start. Here's the rules. You can only pick one number. If somebody else picks the same number you picked, sorry. As Barbie says, that's the suck it up buttercup rule. There will be another giveaway. Um, this is not sponsored in any way by YouTube. This is my giveaway. And, uh, okay, okay, Boosh, 
this is my giveaway um i do ship all over the country all over the world um you do not have to have a purchase to participate nor do you have to like my channel to participate but it makes brownie points with me if you do like my channel but that's just a side note you do not have to so anyway um let's see you can't whine if you don't win and yes i can say that because even though i'm not your boss you still can't whine because whining is very unattractive hi joe Sorensen. And Miss Jude, if you're still here, I did see this sweet, sweet picture. I'm going to put it as my. Uh, But you and Barbie are good at whining. Okay, somebody wanting to know if I did Facebook auctions. No, nope, not doing those no more. So, everybody got your number in? did bob say bob said something to you oh me too barb not bob there we go okay i think i'm gonna put stop in stop Free shipping. Number seven. I see a two and a four and a five. And a seven. I saw a seven, didn't I? Yes, Vex and Rose has seven. Let's make sure nobody up above her has it. Vex and Rose, you won free shipping tonight. Thanks, Lena, for being here. Vex and Rose. Giveaway C. Now she says you guys let her win something. She keeps bidding and nobody will let her win. Okay. Oh, this is so pretty. Okay. This one here is really, really, really pretty. And I hope it will show how pretty it is. So we have this cross. And it has its silver tone and gold tone. Okay. Oops, it flipped around. There we go. So it has a big gold tone bell, and then it has a little gold cross in the middle. And then it has long, skinny baguette rhinestones in clear on the sides. And it's on a really delicate little chain. Let's see what, what it is. What it is. Uh, it 
16 inches long. My nose is itching. There we go. Really pretty little delicate cross. Now, of course, I would hang it backwards. Uh, no, no name or anything on it. And uh, it is not sterling, I don't think. I don't think I tested it. But I don't remember testing it. So, anyway, it was not marked sterling. And usually I always mark all of my sterling. So, we're going to start the bidding on this one at $3, guys. $3. Thanks, Pat. Three dollars on this little uh, cross on the chain. The chain. I know the chain is not sterling. Three dollars on the little cross. It is very tiny and dainty. Let's see. This cross is. About an inch long. About an inch long. I know there's one more cross coming too. Nobody interested in the cross? Three dollars. See if you can see it a little better if I turn that light off. There you go. Three dollars. Okay. Anybody want to give me a pass? If I can get a pass, we'll go on. We'll do a buy it now. If you want to do a $3 buy it now on the cross, your word is going to be sparkle. Sparkle. $3 buy it now on the cross. Your word will be sparkle. Otherwise, we're going to pass on it. We're fixing. What do I want? We're fixing to go on. I got Susan Gillett Sparkle. I want a season pass to somewhere. I didn't know I did. Is that... Is it because I keep saying we're fixing to go on? This one is signed. It says JM on it. I don't know what JM stands for. I didn't look it up. Hold on to this the second I've got it a little tangled. There we go. So we have this dash and dot is what they call this chain dash and dot because it's a dash and then a ball and then a dash and a ball. Oh, I said I wanted a pass. Oh, I got it. I got it. JM. Anybody know what JM stands for? So we're looking at about... Oh, 13, 14, 28 inches long with about a three inch extender. Perpetually. And you have dash and dot and then you have this little ring and you can hook charms or whatever you want on it. And we're going to start the bidding on this. It's still 
as part of its tag on it. J M. It's Jane something. Jane something. The rain is picking up. Hopefully it doesn't mess with my internet. So. Uh, I'm going to start the bidding on this at $3. No, it's Jane. You can see on the thing it says Jane. Or Jan. J-A-N is what it starts out as. J. McClintock. Uh, J A N. So it's it's a brushed gold tone. Three dollars is where we're going to start. It is a brand new necklace. Has a tag says J M on it, and then on the part of the price tag that used to be on it, if you look at, you can see it says J A N M A J A N M A. So. Really cute. Three dollars, guys. Three dollars. Anybody? Goodness. My tea has grounds in the bottom of it. Yeah. Anybody? We'll do a buy it now at three dollars. Oh, got Susan Gillian at three. Going once at three dollars. Going twice at three dollars. This is your final warning. And we're sold to Susan Gill for three dollars. There we go. She bought it now for three dollars. Guys, I'm moving through this pretty quick tonight. Or it feels like it. Maybe I'm just daydreaming. But let's see what this says on it. I think it's, it says jaw pan. Jaw pan. It does say Japan. We have a really pretty vintage Japanese beaded necklace. These are vintage. This could sell on Etsy if you wanted to list it on Etsy. You also could wear it. It is very, very pretty. The colors in it are amazing. And if you wanted to upcycle it into something else, you could do that. But you've got these... Um, Black with glitter, druzy looking beads. You've got these little pink beads. And then you've got these pink swirly beads and these pink faux pearl beads. And uh, we're going to start bidding on this at $2. And these here are looking orange on the screen. And they are pink. Let's see if that helps. They are very pink. Like fuchsia pink. So, we'll start the bidding on this at $2, guys. Got Autumn Grace in it, too. There are a lot of beads here. And they're knotted in between. We've got Age Goodness in it, three. Uh, Vex and Rose, uh, Angela Irene was in at three first. You'll need to go at least three and a quarter. Vita's in at three and a quarter. Let's see. I see Vex and Rose in at five. Vex and Rose is in at $5. They are very pretty. These also came from my friend in Pennsylvania. I love getting jewelry from her because it's just different than what I get at home. You know, the, uh, I get different names from her, different styles. Now, I, I do find a lot of these. 
I tend to hoard them a little bit. Not that I hoard anything. We've got Vex and Rose at $5. Judy Daly says she is out. Vex and Rose is in at $5. Going one time at $5. One time at $5. One time at $5. Autumn Grace is out. Glam Kitty is in at $5.50. Glam Kitty is in at $5.50. Vex and Rose is in at six. Sweet, sweet baby. Oh, you want your name? Age Goodness is out. Vex and Rose is in at six dollars. Going one time at six dollars, guys. One time at six dollars. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Am I talking too loud? Going two times at six dollars. <laughs> oh, he's got to stretch. He's got to stretch those little legs. Glam Kitty says he's out. Going two times at six dollars. Two times at six dollars. Final warning. Final warning. And we're sold to Vexing Rose for $6. Thank you, Vexing Rose. Thank you, thank you very much. Okay. Now, I sold some cufflinks a while ago. And I normally don't just buy things that say they're man jewelry. But I bought a lot of stuff that says it's man jewelry. It's actually a set. Okay. And we're going to start this set at $6. It is brown plated hematite. And uh, stainless steel. Okay. So let's start. With the necklace. Actually, we're going to start with the bracelet. Then we'll show you the necklace. Now, the thing I don't like about this is it is stretch, okay? So, I had never heard of brown plated hematite. So, you've got this brown, these brown links. And then you've got this big, beautiful cross that goes on it. You've got the bracelet that matches it. We're starting at $6 on this set, guys. And it has a matching ring. You've got your head under my armpit, Bubby. There you go. And this is a spinner ring. You've got this brown plated hematite on this. And this ring is a size 10, okay? It is a size 10. So it spins. And it's stainless steel. You've got a stainless steel cross. And you've got the necklace. Now, they stretch, and I don't like that, but I'm not the one that designed it. So, got Vex and Rose in at $6 on this set. It says it is a, it said it was a man set, but I think anybody can wear it. I would wear all of it myself. So, you've got this beautiful... Oh, there it is. Dara. Big cross necklace on brown plated hematite. Sorry, I dropped the black one. So here we go on blue. So you've got that. Oh, Glam Kitty jumped up to nine on this. You've got the bracelet. Very nice bracelet. And the ring. The ring, I love the ring. It spins. 
It's a size 10. Got Glam Kitty in at 9 on this set. Very nice set. Let me take off my Amazonite. There we go. 10. It's beautiful. And that brush brown hematite, brown plated hematite. Vaccine is out. Going one time at $9, guys. One time at $9. Going two times at nine dollars. And final warning. And we're so to Glam Kitty Bob for nine dollars. Thank you, Bob. I think you're gonna love this. Or Tony will. Now get the ring off, put it all back together and back in its pretty little box. And there we go. Thank you. And I'm going to put that inside of a baggie just in case the box comes open. There we go. Okay, you guys might recognize this. You might remember seeing me wear it some last year. I wore it quite a bit last year. Um, this came off of my own jewelry tree, whatever you want to call it. And I hate trying to measure these kind of things. So we're looking at... Seventeen twenty inches is what you're looking at, okay? And uh, I was gonna say it's got to be right at twenty because I don't wear anything that is much shorter than twenty. But Tony doesn't wear jewelry, so well, it's very beautiful. Whoever wears it, so you have these this fringe, and it's silver tone, and this is textured. The if see, can you see that's textured? And uh, we're going to do start this at $2. $2 is silver tone. It's about 20 inches long. Start at $2 on this one. Two dollars on this one. Got Vexen in at two first. Vexen came in at two. Jen Layton came in at two fifty. Let's see. Jen was already in at two fifty. Two seventy five is the next up or three. Vaccine is in at three. Isn't my ammonite ring so pretty? I love ammonite. Glam Kitty is at five. Glam Kitty is at five dollars. Vaccine is out. Jen is out. Going one time at five dollars, guys. One time at five dollars.
and Vita's out. Going two times at five dollars. And we are sold to Bob for $5. Thank you, Bob. Thank you, thank you. Thank you to everybody who bid. Vita, Jen, Vaccine, thank you all. Oh, my gosh, y'all. I found this sat, sat, Saturday, and I absolutely love it. So, if it don't sell, my feelings won't be hurt. <laughs> but... I'm here to sell it, so <laughs> I shouldn't say that. If it don't sell, my feelings won't be hurt. Then you notice it had hair all over it. So we're looking at about 20 inches long with a four inch, 20, yeah, with a three and a half inch extender. Uh, am I sifting through my own hoard? I am selling. I have been selling off some of my own things, yes. Trying to make room for new things to come in. So, you have this. This is not This is not like that crazy stuff. These are individual little links. Okay? So, you have this. You have these big beads. And then you have this big drop thing. And you can almost, you can see into it. Almost. You can see through it. It's just like a big glass bubble almost. And uh, sifting through my own hoard. I'm just getting rid of things that I don't wear much. This did not come out of that. I bought this in uh, Clinton. And this is number 36. And the bidding on this will start at $4, guys. $4. Isn't that amazing? That is so pretty. Four dollars. Got frugalicity in at four. He was first vexing. This is very unique. I uh, unique sales, you know. It just sells. Even when you're selling online and stuff like that, it just sells. And I mean, I know we're online here, but like when you're listing it. Anyway, when we went to decorate the grave, I stopped at one of my favorite thrift stores. There we go. Oh, you can't, we can't see because there's a puppy on us. Well, drats. Puppy, you're blocking our view. We've got vaccine went to five. Frugal went to 550. Yeah, I can get this over my head. I would so wear this. And I debated about keeping it, but... You can't keep everything. You have to throw some of the fish back into the sea. Vaccines at 575. Six dollars. And vaccine is out. Going once at six dollars. Thank you, vaccine, for bidding and letting me know. Going twice at six dollars. Twice at six dollars. Final warning. And sold to frugalicity. Thank you, frugalicity. Thanks, vaccine. Pooters, we dropped our wooer. Let's see how well our little, oh, almost, we almost got it. 
No, you keep dropping it. Puppy dog. There we go. Woohoo, we got it. We almost dropped it again, but we got it that time. We will need our ruler. We need our ruler. Now don't don't you start waking up and getting rowdy. I should have named him Rowdy. This one is another one that is really, really cute. Really. Um, I just really liked it. And I normally don't like anything that has a cord on it. But I just liked it. I think there's enough past the cord. Okay, so it's 15 inches long. And it has a... What looks like to be a three inch extender and it is signed i didn't even realize it was signed no nope, it's not signed it's a is it is it oh yeah it is signed sorry oh v uh it's signed v and i know what that v means and i can't think of it what does that V mean? Here we go. V. Okay. Here you go. Start at $3, guys, on this cute, cute little necklace. It is signed V, and I know what it means, and I can't think. Your hmm. mama's little baby man. Yes, your man's. Hi, Josie. Welcome back. Vivacious. No, that's not. It's. I know it just as well. You see who got their way? Yes, he does get his way quite often. He behaves himself much better up here than sitting down there whining. So. DZ Angie's in at three. Jewelry marks. According to jewelry, timepieces and luxury accessories, heritage auctions. A maker's mark is a unique stamp placed on jewelry and watches to ensure the authenticity of the manufacturer. These stamps are typically made up of the manufacturer's initials. Do you hear all this mess? Representative symbol. Hush. You're not who I want. There we go. That's who I'm looking for. Got Dizzy Angie in at three. Oh. Probably, guys. My hair. Uh, Mary Pelletier's in at 350. And I'm trying to look up this mark for y'all. Because if I don't find it, it will drive me crazy. It's not, I'm not going to find it here. Got Mary Pelletier in at 350. I know that the mark is in the. Yeah, Mary Pelletier in at 350. I know this mark is in the Texas Jewelry Guy Lovers Group uh, Guide. And I want, I mean, it's just on the edge of my brain and I can't think what it's called. Three fifty. Are you still in, Dizzy, or are you out, hun? My hair gets to getting in my ears and it drives me nuts. Makes me feel like something's crawling on me.
No, it's not Valentino. Uh. Got Dizzy in at four. Dizzy Angie is in at four. Let me make sure. It is not Val. Nope, it's not Valentino. I know exactly who it is, and when I tell, when I see it, I'm going to say, "You should remember that. You know that." There. Oh, there. That's not it. There we go. And I really, really want to tell y'all who it is. I got uh, Mary in at 475, Dizzy at 450, Mary at 475. $5 to Dizzy Angie. Here we go. I'm where I need to be to tell you now. There it is. Okay, let me just make sure I'm looking at the right V because there are two V's in this that look very much alike. It's Veronese. Veronese. V-E-R-O-N-E-S-E. -E -E. Veronese. Veronese. So, Mary Pelletier is out. Veronese is the brand. Veronese. And I believe Veronese is sold at Verona stores, but I'm not positive. Veronese. So, do you guys have Verona stores in your area? I love Verona stores. Going once at $5. Going twice at $5. We're sold for five dollars to Dizzy Angie. Uh, I think you've got a bad lag, Frugalicity, because the bid was at five dollars and you just bid three and a quarter. So, oh, HSN and QVC used to sell it. Okay, Veronese. Cool. I knew it looked like it was made very well. So, uh, Frugalicity, you may want to. Oh, I'm sorry. I done said sold. I'm so sorry. So, oh, okay. Hey, Carol, how are you doing, Vargas? No, it's not Vargas, but it looks very similar. The Vargas and the Veronese mark are very, very similar. And you have to uh, watch the way the V is shaped. Um, let me, okay. Let me pull out a piece of paper. Because um, we deal with this about getting them mixed up a lot. Okay, for Veronese, you have more like that. And for the Veronese, okay, sorry, I'm sorry. Am I still here? Yeah. The Veronese has a sharp, the V comes sharp. In the Vargas, he is rounded, but they're almost the exact same shape, same way design. But you've got Veronese has the sharp point, and the Vargas has the the rounded one. So sorry about that. Okay, that was just a little extra for you. We had this really pretty hematite or magnetite. It's not magnetic. Yeah, it's not magnetic. It's hematite. Uh, necklace, let me tell you how long it is. It is... Uh, about 23 inches long.
and it is hematite and you've got these little hematite leaves and we're going to start the bidding on this at four dollars four dollars guys four dollars no that was all free that's like preachers taking a rabbit trail and telling you that was all free for you so you ever heard a preacher do that you got vex and rosie in at four dollars ain't he cute carol he's so adorable he was driving me crazy jumping up on me and scratching me and uh, uh then i picked him up and put him down in my dress and he went right to sleep so hopefully that don't mean he won't sleep tonight but he usually sleeps all evening anyway so yeah vex and rose in at four dollars Frugalicity is in at four and a quarter. This is really nice. I love the I love the leaves. Down here among the leaves, you have some little silver toned beads. I do not know if they're silver or if they're just silver toned. Okay. He is not spoilt. No, he's not spoilt. He is rotten. So, Vexen is in at five. Frugal's in at five and a quarter. Carol, is this uh, your health issues? Uh, is it uh, going to affect your mind? I just pat his little bottom like you do a baby. Vexen Rose is in at 550. Your move. Your move. Your move back to Mississippi. Bex and Rose is at 550. Frugalicity's out. Going once at 550. Going twice at $5.50. This is your final warning. Final warning. And we are sold to Vexing Rose. Okay. That always makes me sad when I hear people say that they have to, to uh, postpone stuff. Because, and this is why. Because uh, you, you get your heart set on the fact that in this amount of time I'm going to go. I'm going home. I'm going back to where I come from, blah, you know, all that. And then when you have to postpone it, it's just sad. So we have a sterling silver rose ring in a size. Who knows? Let us see. It's going to be postponed for three months in a size seven. Can you see that? It is roses. There. Just as I started to move roses. It is made in Indonesia. Sterling silver. And we're going to start at $7 on this, guys. $7 is where we're starting on the ring. Size 7. Start at 7. And it is 925 sterling. Beautiful. Really pretty little ring. There you go. Seven dollars is where we're starting on this size seven roses ring. Vita Vita, where are you? You like your roses. Yes, it is nine to five. 
Michelle. It is 925, yes. Vita's in at 7. Do I go out? It's raining hard here. Michelle's in at eight. I didn't know you had one too, Bob. Did you have one too? Now you guys need to watch your blood pressure. I knew Tony had one, but I didn't know that Bob had one. Jewelry therapy always helps, though. Helps everything. I'm a firm believer in that. Jewelry th therapy helps. I don't like that over there. Vita's in at eight and a quarter. Oh, my goodness. Michelle's in at 8.50. Your kidneys are doing better. Good. It's dinner time for you. What you having for dinner? Something good, I hope. 875 to Vita. Is your function up, Vita? Nine to Michelle. Vita is out. Going one time at $9. Very good, Vita. I'm happy to hear that. Going one time at $9. Going two times at $9. This is your final warning. Final warning. And we are sold for $9 to Miss Michelle. Thank you, Michelle. Y'all have both had two each. Are you taking your blood pressure medicine? <laughs> Listen, I take my blood pressure medicine every day, religiously. I do not want to have a stroke. I also take a blood thinner so I don't have a stroke. So, Okay, guys, we have these beautiful little uh, seed beads in this really pretty tan ecra color. has a matching bracelet. This is ecra colored, and it this one has a button fastener, and they feel like glass. They feel like glass or stone, and I'm not sure which, but they do feel like glass or stone. You have a matching necklace and bracelet. Let me tell you how long the necklace is. Let's see. Has a button closure. Where's my Ruger? There's my Ruba. You're looking at 22 inches on the necklace. And then the bracelet is um, stretch. So, okay. We're going to start at $4 on this lot. Because even if you don't want to wear it like this, that's a lot of beads to craft with if you want to break it down. $4, guys. $4 on this beautiful set. $4. Those make great spacer beads. $4 on this beautiful set. Got Glam Kitty in at 4 
Got Bob Glen Kitty in it for anybody else coming in on these? Going one time at four dollars. Going two times at four dollars. Two times at four dollars. This is your final warning. Have to recheck your thyroid in five weeks. Dave's thyroid is dead from taking a certain kind of medicine. So he he's on a sin thyroid all the time. Uh, uh, Leviathyroxine. So, anyway. And we are sold for $4 to Bob. Thank you, Bob. Mm, I'm looking for something. Oh, that was number 40, guys. It's time for another giveaway. Another giveaway. One to fifty and start. And I'll show y'all what we're giving away. We still have 34 people. Thank you guys for hanging with me. I still have about 10 more things. Plus, then we have that really nice, um, really nice. Uh, <laughs> Angela Irene will like this one if she wins it. So. We have that really nice uh, little bag to give away that's full of jewelry, full of jewelry, a little ipsy bag. So, so we have this little glass seed bead with this little Murano um, art glass pendant, art glass pendant on it. Pick a number. You know the rules, but we'll go over them again. This is not associated with YouTube. This is my giveaway. You can only pick one number one time. If somebody else picks your number, I'm sorry. This is That is the suck it up buttercup rule that Barbie made, and we all follow it. Um, let's see. If uh, Let me think. I ship all over the United States. You do not have to have a purchase to win. Nor do you have to like my page. Um, and no whining allowed. So, I think that covered them all. They're printed on my description of my thing. They print every week and set, show up on my on my description. Hey, Deb Vlogs. Welcome. My sweet little man. I'm a good little rascal. Is you a good little rascal? You can't even wake up and say hi to the people. No. Okay. I'm just exhausted. He's played hard all day. Yes, he played hard all day. No, we're not going to hang our head like that. Mom don't like when you hang your head like that. Can you put your head back up here? Put your head back, head back right up there. Right there. Catch it right there. There you go. That's good. Mom always thinks it hurts your neck when you hang your head like that. So, congrats winners. He said, hey people, you're disturbing my nap. So, he's just happy his mama's holding him. So, so. Okay, it looks like everybody's got their number in, so I'm going to push stop. And tonight has been the night for people getting right on the number again. Right on the number. Here we go. The number is 31. And I know I saw somebody enter that number a while ago. 31. I think it was Vita. Let's see. 
Let me go up here and look. I do see 31 with Vita. Let me make sure nobody else had 31 up here. Oh, Vita is the winner. Right? Is that what you guys are seeing? Vita won. Congratulations, Vita. You have to have a major thyroid son sonogram. This is giveaway D. Vida. Vida. There we go. Very good. Okay, guys. This is a set that is just... Ugh, it's so gorgeous. And I actually did not buy them together as a set. But then when I got them... I realized uh, that makes a set because they're the exact same thing stone-wise. So, let me pull this out and tell you what this is. So, we have a... Twenty inch snake skin jasper necklace. The chain is stainless steel and it has a magnetic closure. Magnetic closure. It is snake skin jasper. This little pendant here that it sets on is sterling. The pendant is sterling. The chain is um. Stainless steel. I'm sorry. My mind went so blank. Okay. So that's the necklace. And then. And we're going to start this set at $8. Guys. We're going to start this set. The bidding on this at $8. You have stainless steel and sterling there. And I'm trying to get it. Okay. Here. And then we have. A size 6 ring. That is snake skin jasper, and it is set in all stainless, okay? Size 6 snake skin jasper ring. Here's the ring. It's called snake skin jasper, and here's the necklace. And they are both snake skin jasper. And I'm selling them as a set. We've got Bob in at 8. This ring is a size 6. The ring is stainless steel. The necklace is stainless steel, except for the pendant is silver. Judith Daly is in at eight fifty. It is a very pretty set, and they're a little bit different, but they're the exact same stone. So I thought that they should go together. You can't believe how good he's been. <laughs> Me too. You got Judy in at eight fifty. Bobby Bob is in at nine. The ring is a size six, guys. Size 6 in stainless steel. Judy's in at 950. Glam Kitty's in at 10. He is snuggly. We've got Style with Pat in at 10.50. Uh, Pat came in first at 10.50.
Judy's in at 11. About time for my bangs to be cut. I'm not sure about this hair. Bob is out. Judy's in at 11. Pat is out. We're going once at $11 with Judy. Going twice at $11 with Miss Judy. This is your final morning. Final warning, and we are sold to Judy Daly for $11. Thank you, Judy. It's really pretty, and I love that it had the magnetic closure. Put the ring back in this little bag. Okay, I have some fun, something fun here. We are going to start the bids on this at a dollar. And these are stretch rings that look like dyed halite. This one is dyed halite. We're going to start. That's what the back of it looks like. You've got a dollar. Ooh, that sounds good pizza. We had pizza yesterday twice we actually bought two pizzas had one for lunch and one for dinner so you've got this big bundle of beads if you wanted to take it apart and use it starting the bids at a dollar on this ring a dollar Hey, Russell, Russell, can we get any more comfortable? Are you getting uncomfortable in there? Is your little booty starting to hurt, laying all scrunched up in there? No? Okay. One dollar. We got Vex and Rose in at a dollar. Oh, sweet baby boy. I cooked lunch real early today, like it was ready before 4 o'clock. And I ate then, and now I feel hungry again. So, Bex and Rose at a dollar going once. Bex and Rose at a dollar going twice. And sold for a dollar to Vex and Rose. Thank you, Vex and Rose. Thank you, thank you. Oh, I'm sorry, Mary. I done said sold before. Yeah, I'm sorry. But I've got some more of those in a different color. Just in a few minutes, so... Got one in red and one in, uh, I don't know what other color I have tonight. Oh, uh, let me see. You think all auctions should have puppies? We're looking right at 24 inches long. So the chain is like this. The pendant is marked Trafari. Okay, guys? The pendant is marked Trafari, and we're going to start the bidding on this. Be still. Be still. We'll start the bidding on this at $3. The chain, I think, is added on. This came out of my jewelry, off of my jewelry shelf, uh, off my jewelry pole. Um, but I just didn't wear it, and so I thought somebody might like it. Start at $3 on this. $3 on the Trafari pendant with the chain. And it's Mark Trafari right here. Here's the cartouche. Right in here. Shafari. 
I think that's real cool. That brush silver. Got Barbie in it. Three. Mm, you may have a little bit of a lag. Uh, vaccine. Barbie came in first at three. Not too much later because I only have a few more things to go. It's going to be a short night tonight. Actually, we just went through it real quick. And I'm really surprised. Got Vexen in at four. Vexen is in at four. Uh, I'm real surprised at how fast it's gone. That ring, like I sold her for a dollar. I have it in coral color and tiger's eye. Got frugalicity in at four and a quarter. Frugalicity is in at four and a quarter. That brushed and that shiny together is just really cool. Vexing is in at five. Are you being a good boy? I love that big bright red rose. Five dollars to vexing rose. Five dollars to vexing rose. Going once. Frugalicity, are you in or out, bud? Oh, Frugalicity's back at five and a quarter. That's a hair. Now I'll knock it. Five fifty to Vex and Rose. And frugalicity is out. We're going one time at five dollars and fifty cents. We're going two times at five dollars and fifty cents. And we are sold to Vexen Rose for five dollars and fifty cents. Thank you, Vexen. Thank you, thank you. I'm trying to uh, measure the length of this little chain. Oh, it's twenty-four inches long. Be still, you little monkey. Okay, guys. I see how it works now. Isn't that interesting? So, I've never seen such. So, you have a 14 carat rose gold over sterling silver necklace. And it's 24 inches long when it's extended all the way to its longest point. Okay. Hey, paint and the rose is red. Okay. So this is what you're looking at. It's rose gold. It's 14 karat gold over sterling silver. And then it slides like this. Has a little heart dangle. And it slides and you can wear it like that with the little heart dangle. Like that. So it's rose gold, 14 karat gold, rose gold over sterling. And we're going to start the bidding at $6. $6 is where we're starting. 
six dollars on this 14 karat rose gold. We got Michelle in at six. And I'm going to pull the, there we go. We got Michelle in at six. Yeah. Don't hang your head like that, baby. Judy Daly's in at six fifty. Susan Gill is in at seven. Judy's in at eight. We have Judy in at eight. Very, very pretty. And the way it cut is cut makes it shine. Judy Daly's in at eight. Looking for eight and a quarter, guys, or eight fifty works. Eight fifty to Michelle Daly. Uh, Michelle Daly. Michelle Line. Michelle L. We've got Susan Gill in at 10. She jumped up to 10. Susan Gill is in at 10. I hear you. Judy Daly is in at 10.50. Michelle is in at 11. Susan Gill is out. We have Michelle in at 11. Susan Gill says she is out. Thank you, Miss Susan, for bidding. How many inches long? Extended all the way down to as long as it'll go is 24 inches, okay? But to wear it with the little heart, see, it slides down that. To wear it with the little heart dangle. But it's 24 at its longest point, okay? And then you can slide it in at any point and make the little heart slide down. Got Judy in at 11.50. Michelle's in at 12. Twelve fifty. Thirteen. Thirteen fifty. Fourteen. Fourteen fifty. Fifteen dollars, guys. Fifteen dollars. This is a brand new piece. It's not a used piece. It is brand new. Fifteen fifty cupcakes. Are those cupcakes or shakes? Popcorns. Sixteen. Yes. Daddy's going to bed. You want to go to bed with Daddy? I imagine not, but I thought I'd ask. Sixteen fifty. I was looking at the markings on it because I hadn't looked at the markings on it. I know that it's fourteen karat gold, rose gold, because that was what the 
my paperwork said, but it is marked 925, so, but it is 14 karat rose gold over sterling, so, $17 is where we are. Yeah, it's really pretty. Seventeen fifty. Eighteen. Eighteen fifty. Eighteen dollars and fifty cents is where we are. I love the sparkle to it. There is another mark. Got twenty dollars in the Michelle. Twenty fifty. Twenty fifty is where we are. Twenty one dollars. Twenty one fifty. Twenty two. Twenty two dollars, guys. We are at twenty two dollars. I'm just making noise. Did I disturb you? There you go, your ears. And Judy Daly says she's out. We're going once at $22 to Michelle. Going twice at $22. Oh, big yawns. Big yawns. And we are sold for $22 to Michelle. No, mom don't want kissed in the face. No. Nope. Oh, mom don't want kissed in the face. If we do that, you have to get down. Okay. Let's see if we can turn ourselves into a pretzel. Are you ready to get down and go? Do you got to get down and go to the pee pee pad? Do you need to get down and go pee pee? Get down and go to the pee pee pad? Nope. Okay. Congrats. Thank you both for bidding. Thank you. Okay, yeah. Nosy, nosy, Rosie. You, you're you going to have to get down. When you start getting nosy about it all, you have to get down. Go to the pee-pee pad and go pee-pee. Go on. Be a good boy. Okay, so we have this one here. I do believe these are just dyed halide. I don't think they're coral. So we, done the, we started the other one at... Uh, a dollar. We're going to start this one at a dollar too. There I am. We've got a red stretchy ring starting at a dollar. Starting at a dollar. The next thing coming up is something very interesting, but we're getting really close to being done. Got Barbie in at a dollar. Susan Gill is in at a dollar fifty. Now I'll feel like I've got buggies crawling all over me because his little hairs. Okay, we have Susan Gill in at a dollar. Susan 
There we go. Vex and Rose is in it. Two dollars. There he goes. He was a good boy for a hour or so. A couple hours there, wasn't he? So, two dollars. Barbie is out. Susan, you in or you out? Yes, you can wait to be shipped after until after the Wednesday auction. I will invoice you tomorrow, but you can wait to be shipped after the auction. So you can combine this can combine the shipping, yes. Vaccine is out. Susan says two fifty. Going once. He is a good puppy. Going twice. And sold to Susan Gill. And they were made in Indonesia. They're not from China. So, but. Sold to Susan Gill. Okay, guys. I know this is not free, but it is really pretty. And let me just get my little eyeball and tell you what it says on the bottom. It says C O L L C O L L B O L, I think, or B O K. Anyway, I think it sparks. I think all it needs is lighter fluid, but it is so pretty. Look at that the cigarette lighter. Now, the flint sparks, but I think all it needs is lighter fluid in it. And it, it is signed C-O-L-L -L something. I didn't even do any research. I picked that up Saturday at my favorite jewelry uh, place that I always stop when I go up north. And uh, we're going to start the bidding on this at $4, guys. $4 is where we're starting. Four dollars. I know people collect vintage cigarette lighters. Get out from under there. Get out from under there. No, you're not coming back up. Got Mary Pelletier in at four. Yep. Vaccine is in at four fifty. It is so pretty. You had a lighter like that in the 70s. I'm sure it's probably vintage. I didn't try to open up anything on it. Calibri. Calibri. I couldn't sell, say what it. And it's made in Japan. Yours with silver. Vexen is in at five. Feel like I got a hair on me. Five and a quarter. C O L. Yep. C O L. Yep. That's it. C O L B R I. Vaccine is out. Mary Pelletier is in at five and a quarter. Guys, remember, even though after we finish that very last thing, I have one more giveaway. You don't want to leave because that one is for $5 off. Okay. Going once at five and a quarter. Yeah, I knew several. I have sold several lighters. I've sold. One to you, I got, I've sold this one, and I sold one to uh, Reverend Michelle a while back. So, going twice at five and a quarter. This is your final warning. Final warning. 
and was sold to Mary Pelletier. Thank you, Mary. Okay, this is the final one of the stretchy rings. This one is done in browns and tiger's eye beads. There are some tiger's eye beads in this. Oh, I'm sorry. You do have a lag, Frugalicity. I am so sorry. It was sold and thrown in the bucket before I even saw your bid come in. So we're at a dollar here. Starting at a dollar, guys, on this ring. It does have some tiger's eye beads in it. You can see them in there. But we start at a dollar on this one. Barbie's in at a dollar. Barbie, come in first, Mary. You have to go up. Glam Kitty's in it, too. My hair gets in my ears, and it just gives me the heebie-jeebies. I'm not used to having long hair, I can tell y'all. For me, this is very long. <laughs> this is like, oh. I know that some of you people have hair probably down to your backsides but this is long to me i'm not used to long hair barbie's out glam kitty's at two going once at two dollars going twice at two dollars This is your final warning. Final warning. And we're sold for $2 to Glam Kitty. Thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you. Okay, guys. I have a beautiful set here. Beautiful set. And I'm just going to tell you, there is an issue with this set. And I was just sick. But. He's biting his foot and crying. So, we have these turquoise colored beads, and they have these little shells in them, and they have this beautiful wooden buckle, okay? This is the bracelet. It stretches. This beautiful wooden buckle. No issue with that, okay? None. The necklace... The buckle broke. The very first thing that happened, there was a crack in this buckle right here, and it broke. I have tried to glue it back. It is very fragile. Now, I will tell you that it will still stay fastened even without that piece on it. But that's what makes the piece is the buckle. But the beads are awesome on this. They're absolutely gorgeous. And we're going to start this at $4. I mean, I know that there's a little piece here that's broken. And I'm going to show it a little bit better. If you see here, there's a crack all the way through it. I have glued it. And for now, it's on. But it is wiggly. So, I can't guarantee that it'll ship and stay on. Because it cracked in the shipping to me. Hush, you're being noisy. Okay, $4. It is gorgeous. I love, love it. I probably, I don't know. There's, let's see, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen strands on that. And two, four, six, eight, ten. 12, 14 strands on the bro. You have a wooden buckle like that. I imagine you could, if you knew where to, you probably could buy one at, at, the, at a, a crafting store. But replacing it would be, it would make me nervous. So, anyway, I wouldn't ever replace it. $4. Susan Gill is in at $4. So pretty, though. 
Susan Gill is in at four dollars. I will wrap the I will wrap around tissue paper. You think a little epoxy? I used uh, some kind of a glue, uh, a, a a rhinestone glue. I didn't have a any kind of epoxy, so but uh, uh, I think you could probably get it fixed. Anyway, I don't know if Susan's buying it to deconstruct or to wear. So going twice at four dollars, but I'll wrap that up the best I can so it don't get broke off. E six thousand. Yeah, I don't have no E six thousand. Going twice, and we are sold to Susan Gill for four dollars. No, you can't have mommy yet. Mommy's almost done, but not yet. Guys, we have 50 total, and this is number 49. This one here, come off of my wall. Off the wall in my room. If you've watched any of my videos where I show my personal jewelry, you know I have all kinds of hooks and stuff on my walls. And this came off the wall off of the wall this one is about 19 inches long with what looks like to be about right at four inch extender really really cute it's on a whatever kind of chain that is is that a snake chain is that what they call a snake chain and i do have a thing for these little flapper flappers everyone should have e6000 well, I don't have any. So, oh, I didn't even tell y'all. Uh, let's start the bidding on this at $2, guys. $2. Got Joe Ellen in it, too. Remember, if you bought something tonight, I will send your invoice tomorrow. But if you want me to wait on the shipping... Let me know, please. Let me know. We will be having a craft sale on Bougie's channel uh, Wednesday afternoon at 2 o'clock Eastern Time. That is 1 o'clock Central Time and noon uh, California Time. No. 11 California Time. 11 California time. Okay, Mary wants to wait on hers. Wait. I'm putting a W. And Susan wants to wait on hers. Okay. So, we've got Joellen in at 2, 3. Let's see. Glam's at 4. And Joellen's in at 5. Sorry. Mary, uh, Mary's out. We do this once a month. We have once a month. We have a crafting sale where we sell stuff to craft jewelry with. We might sell uh, yarn. We might sell scrapbook supplies. You never know what we're gonna have. Never, <laughs> because we we enjoy that. That's one of our chances to get out. I have uh, some of that thin uh, cotton crochet yarn that like you make doilies out of this time and I have a lot of jewelry for for uh, uh, crafting with so we've got Joellen at five going once Joellen at five going twice and we're sold to Joellen for five dollars Okay, this is my final thing for the night. Let me weigh it, and then I will tell you what is in it, okay? Because I want to, so you know. Okay, it weighs 14.7 ounces. If you bought anything else, you will be over a pound on it, 
and it will go flat rate. If this is, if this is the only thing else you bought, it can ship for first class, but it'll be probably be about five fifty. Okay, so we have an Ipsy bag. There are thirty items in this bag. You have a bunch of stone items, like I said, rose quartz. There's some um, some uh, agate. Uh, there are also two pieces of sterling silver. One of them is a ring that came out of my jewelry box. And one of them is a bracelet or an anklet. Um, let's see. You have name brand pieces in here. I'm going to give you a sneak peek at one thing that's in here. You have this little brooch that is a metal cameo that has a Puritan lady on it. And y'all are real lucky I put that in there because normally that would have stayed with me. You have a lot of, um, of, uh, of stone things. Here is Adventurine with some Carnelian. Uh, here is a pair of earrings that look like they have opal glass or opals in them. Uh, yeah. So there's 30 items, uh, two pieces of silver, and I'm just going to show y'all the ring that came out of my jewelry box. Oh, in with the ring, you're going to think, why did she put those in there? are some little Labradot chips, okay? So I have some Labradot chips in there too. But this little ring, I bought this little ring from Margaret. And uh, this is enameled. It is not a stone, okay? So here's a little sterling silver ring. And that is enameled. It is not a stone. And it is sterling and it has been tested. And I wore that a lot. And uh, I think it's about a size 7. And we're going to start this whole lot. We're going to start bidding at $15. That is less than a dollar a piece. Start at $15 on the Ipsy bag. Got Barbie in at 15 first. Barbie came in first at 15. Judy Daly's in at 16. I know there is Avon, a couple of Avon. Vexing Rose jumped up to 20. She's trying to maximize on her free shipping, and that's just perfectly fine. Uh, you have some amethyst beads here. There's some of that new old stock. A couple pairs of those earrings are in there. There's a copper pair of earrings in here. There's a trafari piece in here. Yeah, there's some nice things in here, guys. Nice, nice stuff in here. So... Very much worth. So, let's see. It looks like Judy Daly was first with her $26 bid on my end. Judy, Judy Daly. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to wait. I'm not going to call it fast, okay? I'm not going to call it. Vex and Rose is in at 30. Hi, puppy. You're playing. Playing with this Santa hats. Vex and Rose is in at 30. Judy Daly is in at 31. And she barely got ahead of you on that one. 31, Mary. Uh, good night, Dizzy Angie. What? Thanks for being here. Thank you for being here. Vexing is out. So we have Judy Daly in at $31, guys. $31.
31 dollars Mary Pelletier is at 32. Thirty-two to Mary Pelletier. Guys, thanks for hanging with me. Thirty-three to Judy Daly. Thirty-three to Judy Daly. There's thirty-two people still here. And we done, guys. This is the crazy thing. We done as many lots tonight as we done last week. With the exception of maybe two on the three dollar lot. But uh I guess I just moved faster tonight. I don't know. So Mary Pelletier is out. Going once at thirty three dollars, guys. One time at thirty three dollars. Going two times at $33. Two times. Oops. Glam Kitty's in at $34. Glam Kitty is in at $34. We have Glam Kitty in at $34. Guys, I bought a bunch of Ipsy bags the other day. Glam Kitty is in at $34. Judy Daly is in at $35. Not vaccine. See you next week, I hope. Judy Daly is in at $35. $35. Thirty-five dollars. Going what? Are you in or out, Bob? Going one time at thirty-five dollars. Wait to see what Bob says. There we go. Going one time at thirty-five dollars. Bob is in at 36. Bob is in at 36. 36. Judy's in at 37. Did y'all see that? I picked up this piece of paper and started wadding it up. Here he comes. He loves paper. You want that paper bowl? There you go. $37 to Judy Daly. Good night, Bobby Pizzelli. Thanks for being here, hon. He takes it over there and he unwads it and tears it in little bitty pieces. I have little bitty pieces of paper all in my office floor. But that's okay. It's my office. I can shut the door. Bob is out. Bob is out. Going one time at $37, guys. Going two times at $37. Final warning, and we are sold. Y'all don't leave. I'm fixing to do another giveaway. We are sold to Judy Daly for $37. Thank you, Judy. Now, pick a number 1 to 50 and start. This one is for a $5 off discount. $5 off discount. $5 off discount. 
And if you didn't buy, if you bought and it's not $5, I will give you the difference in shipping. If you bought something for $3, which your shipping will be $3, so it would be $6. You'd only have to pay a dollar. So anyway, but whatever, however, it works. So. $5 discount, or I'll give you $5 PayPal money. Uh, I'm, it's just my ink pen, puppy. It's just my ink pen. You want to come back up here so you can say bye-bye to the people? Yes. Him does. Him does. Him wants to buy. Oh, you're hurting me. Oh, oh, you hurt mommy. You hurt her. Oh, no, you hurt her. Yes, you give her loves. <laughs> okay, has everybody got your number in? Everybody got your number in? Don't bite me. Don't bite me. And I'm going to type stop. And there we go. Stop. And here is your number. Your number is 25. 25. 25. Sorry, that we'll count it. See, 10, 25. Hey, hey, hey. You can't. You can't chew on tape. It looks like Barbie is the winner. Is that what you're seeing? Barbie is the winner. I see Barbie at 26. I don't see anybody else closer than that. 26. It looks like Barbie won. Congrats, Barbie. Guys, thanks for a great get, great sale tonight. Barbie, five dollar discount. And if you did not buy, I can't. I know you bid on several things, but I don't know if you ever won anything. If you didn't buy, I'll just send you a five dollar uh, PayPal. I shall. I shall. I don't think you bought anything, Barbie. Don't. No, there you are. There's pink earrings. You won your pink earrings. It looks like you're only going to have to pay a dollar to get your pink earrings. They were three dollars. Your shipping would be three dollars. So, anyway, remember if you need me to wait until after Wednesday. Don't give you a gift card. Well, listen, Barbie, you, yeah. You bought the pink earrings. Remember, you won them. So, anyway. That, I was going to say, do I have a big bruise there? Nope. I don't. Okay. Thanks, everybody, for being here. I appreciate you all. Remember, we'll be back Wednesday on Bougie's channel at 2 o'clock Eastern, 1 o'clock Central. Can I wait until after Wednesday to ship for you? Yes. I can wait until after Wednesday to ship for you. Yes, I can. So, let me write a W beside your name. Wait. Okay. So, uh, that is a crafting sale. It is, I mean, we will have jewelry items to craft with, but it is a crafting sale. So, okay. And uh, that is on Bougie Bear Vintage is the name of her channel, Joellen. Bougie Bear Vintage. So, Okie dokie, we will see you, and if you guys want to friend me on Facebook, my name is Cindy Slinker Lovin' there, and all of my videos are, uh, okay, I'll hold on to it, Barbie, uh, are, um, all of my videos are announced, all of our sales and stuff are announced on my channel, so, okay, I shall see y'all Wednesday, so, have a good one, bye-bye.
Say bye, Russell. Say bye, bye.